do. Well, howdy, howdy. Um, it's Wednesday, and uh, previously I was playing Monster Sanctuary, and I not so ragey, but I quit it because it's fucking hard, and I just... I'll wait for the update to where they actually make it slightly easier. Um, it's a really fun game. It's a great game, but I ain't that good at it anymore. Like I've hit my ceiling. So we're just going to keep playing fucking Minecraft because we got the crew here tonight and we actually have several of them. Um, so hi everybody. Hello. 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 All right. So be quiet. Because I'm stuffing my face full of the chimkins still. Mmm, chimkins. Speaking of things that look and smell delicious, um, so we just got new candles. Well, I got a candle. Uh, Sabrina got some wax melts. Um, and they're all Disney themed. And so I'm going to try this out. I'm actually going to light this and have this like going while I'm uh, I'm playing tonight. But it's 100 acre wood. It's very fragrant. Um, it's, it's very, let's see if you, come on light. Uh, it's so bright. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's better. So pretty stuff because I am a bear. Um, and I know you can't see him up on the shelf, but Pooh Bear's up there on the shelf. So he's up there. Um, so in honor of him and being a bear, I'm going to light this bad boy. God, I can smell it. It's like so fragrant already. Uh, your chat should probably let you know how they like the smell. I, I'm, I'm hoping I'm hoping the chat will let me know if they like the smell of the candle. But folks, we have open flame, so you know if if things start getting extremely bright during the broadcast, you'll know why. Um, and please let Zach know. Also, yes, yes, please, please let me know in the chat if if behind me everything gets really bright and I don't notice it for some reason. Um, but I've been doing a lot of stuff um, in my spare time the last couple of days. And uh, with that, let's uh, let's kind of get into it. Let's get into this realm and see what kind of damage I've caused. Uh -oh. oh, yeah, so much. All right, let's see. Nope, nope, nope. We'll, we'll come back to this in a second. All right, um... Let's go. Let's go upstairs for a minute. Oh yes, come visit me. Hello. Uh, because I am sitting down to mine uh, some of the ill-gotten gains that our mole has brought back. That is a lot of diamond. I think right? we're like thirty-five like or something. Thirty-five. You brought back thirty-five, so I felt like I needed to lay it all out at once, so that the stream could really appreciate. Uh, what I'm sitting down to mine right here. <laughs> this is fantastic. And what you your pick has what Fortune two on it? Uh, that sounds right. And if I were a real Minecraft player, I'd know that Fortune two and efficiency three. So Ooh. I'm gonna go through this like nobody's business. Nom nom uh, nom nom nom. But but all the actual credit goes to Elena. Uh, Elena. <laughs> yeah, she 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 is our she is our head mole. She's our. She's our CTO, our chief tunneling officer. <laughs> Love it. You know, I know some businesses that might be better off if that were what their CTO actually, what the CTO title meant. I think that means that we've been working in tech too long. <laughs> that seems likely. Mm, look at all that diamond. I'm like I'm I'm curious at this point to see how much you got. All hail the mole. <laughs> yeah, so that works out to hang on, let me check. Sixty one actual diamonds. Ooh, out of that's five that's, that's basically a fucking stack. Nice. Yeah. So nicely done. So since I bring it back to be fortuned. Yeah. So Mo's been working on her getting supplies for her nether project, um, and something else, I forget what. But she's got a lot of stuff in here, um, a lot of glass, and now a lot of other stuff. Um, I don't know what else she's working on. Does um, she need I, more sand, or is she doing good? Um, she's she's out of sand. I think I'll grab some from the box, because I know there's a bunch in the box. Okay. So let me grab some real quick. 
because I can always grab more at some point. I'm just working on a tunnel to a place I want to go because I have a project I want to do eventually. Okay. All right, that's that's all but one row, which, I mean, let's be real, that's all we're going to do with this goddamn sand anyway is make glass out of it. Right, be it from Mo or someone else. All righty. Glass machine is going. Uh, that should, yeah, that should be fine. Um, oh, good, more redstone. We're... We will have a lot more very soon. Yeah. Uh... There were three and a half stacks, I believe. Yep. I'm still just laying out the first one to start mining it. We will uh, not have a shortage. Um, we have currently 22 stacks of redstone blocks, plus a few more. Um, I think at this point it's safe to just move this down. I was going to say, just, just one row just, of redstone. Just, just one row of redstone and another extra row of blocks. Yeah. So we have a shit ton of that. Um, I know, Elena, you got a bunch of bamboo earlier for Tom, because Tom's like still... Oh, sorry, stacks. go ahead. No, I did like four stacks, but it's already regrowing, I think. I put it in the bamboo chest. Oh, yeah, there's... Wait, it's in the bamboo chest? I put the bamboo I found in the bamboo chest, because we have a bamboo chest. Oh. It... Oh. Oh, I must have gone up one... Whoop. Listen, it's okay. Eventually, I want to redo this. I already don't like storage. I already don't like it, and I want to redo it. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I, we will redo it. We'll we'll get to that part in just a little bit. Um, but yeah, um, what I would like to do also at some point is take all of this this um, new walkway here, um, which I'm pretty happy about with the stone brick slabs and then the smooth stone slabs, and extend it down and then over to um, the renovated village so that we have like a direct line there. Um, and I might end up also out in this large area behind the barn, um, branch off of the um, the path here, the, the walkway, and then put a dock out here because um, I think that would be fun to have a little fishing dock. Do it. So, That'd be cool. Yeah. So let's go back up here. Let's see. Where's Kidarino? Oh, Kidarino, he's such a good boy. Kidarino, yeah. are you a good boy? He's a good boy here. You know what? He's been he's such a good boy a good... when he doesn't sit on chests. Well, listen. He was there first. <laughs> He's been so Does good. Does he actually stop them from opening if he sits on them? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. He's he's he's, it, he's he's a mob, uh, so he will actually it will actually cause you to to not be able to open the chest because he's he is a block on top of it. Hey, little uh, buddy, you okay. so good you get to fish. I need to move the other oh, the fish other animal out of the bedroom there then. Oh no, the bedroom. They only move. They only move because he uh Zach uh sits up Kitarino to sleep oh, every night. Right. If yeah, you, so he brings me stuff. Un yeah, if you don't actually unsit them, they they don't move. So yours are fine. Yeah, yours are all good. <laughs> it's just Zach that's the problem. Right. Yeah. No, I mean, which is which is pretty pretty par for the course. Also, um, fun fact: uh, I went ahead and took the one treasure map and I filled it out. I appreciate you so much for doing so, that because so it was it's driving all me nuts. So yeah, the treasure map's filled out, and you can see like our, our pathway down there, and the barn, and the village, and all the stuff that Lollipop's been doing over there, and the farm there. Like, it's it's so pretty. Like, it looks very, very nice. That so, is cool. How do you actually go about filling that out? Do you have to like take it with you, or do you just have to explore all that area? You have to have it with you when you're exploring. So I, ta I actually uh -huh. took my okay. boat, and I went down here, came back up and around... And then went down through here, and then because I ran out of water, I actually went up on uh, on top up here, uh, up that that scaffolding over there, and then uh, came down and around uh, the mountain to get that. I all love how obvious the barn is on that. I know, I know, I love it. Like <laughs> there is no mistaking the barn right there. 
Yeah, like the barn and the nether portal, like you could just see right where those are at. Yeah. All right. I mean, uh, I like walking around the world and I just see the barn. I think it's I think it's sleepy times. It is sleepy yep, times. I'm just finishing making my hill of redstone to mine and then I will go to bed. We do not yeet the cat. <laughs> there will be no cat eating. We can yeet we can yeet Liara. Oh well you can le yeet yeah, yeet Liara, but you know <laughs> that's she's this week she's a bad goddamn kitty. <laughs> we'll eventually kitty forgive Rio. her. I know, but it it would be yet. it'd be a lot. It, you'd forgive her a lot faster if the uh, if the beanbag chair wasn't basically brand new. Uh, yeah, pretty much. That's uh, yeah. uh, okay. This explains the beanbag talk earlier. I was pretty confused. Yeah. Uh, yeah, my cat decided that the new beanbag that I bought after Christmas with our uh, CC rewards was a uh, fair game for uh, turning into a litter box. No. Yeah. Yeah. That's a that was not very Kitterino of her, I gotta tell you. It was not very Kitterino of her. Yeah. Um oh also, uh I have uh I got tired of waiting for my netherrack to cook, so I got it on a double burner now. So I'm cooking a Is that shit a thing ton you can more. Do? Yes. Oh you're I see you're cooking two times as much. I Only am two. I gotcha. Only two. Only two. Actually, <laughs> Listen, I'm I'm trying not to be greedy. Has spoken. <laughs> as as she do. <laughs> rookie numbers, you gotta pump up those numbers. <laughs> <laughs> Oops, Nether bricks are for um, closers. <laughs> <laughs> so Did I have this problem where this pick is so efficient that occasionally I do just go through the floor. It's Sorry okay. About that. That's okay. We have stone. I can put a stone in there. Uh, yeah, so um, an end game room that we usually do is we either um, make make a room down in bedrock for the for doing what you're doing, or we uh, make an obsidian room specifically for what you're doing. Yeah, oh, just because then you can't go through it accidentally. Yep. Yeah. Because even with an efficiency eighteen or whatever the top one is, you can't do a obsidian in one or two hits. Sorry, it goes higher <laughs> than efficiency three? And yeah, it goes like up five. Five, buddy. Five. And let me tell you, <laughs> a, a diamond pick with efficiency five is a deadly ass weapon when and it's only towards yourself. <laughs> that's, that's, you're going right. to kill yourself with it. <laughs> that's how you die. Everything that is between you and lava in approximately two seconds. Uh, that's, yeah, about. yeah, that's about right. Yeah, Play in the nether. Oh God! Don't even talk With to me about that. Oh my God! <laughs> Pickaxe go brrrr. <laughs> <laughs> that is exactly what efficiency five does. That is one hundred percent what efficiency five does. Uh, it goes uh, brrr. Brrr. Like, what yeah. Is the origin of goes brrr. Uh, it's listen. The internet's a weird place, man. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like I've heard it. I've heard it a million times, and it just occurred to me. I don't know where it started. <laughs> I don't who, know. Who I just say? know it's the internet. It's been lost to the annals of history. <laughs> probably for the best, then. Probably. I was going to say, you could probably Google it, but do you really want to do that? <laughs> no, I do not. Thank you. Don't don't Thank spoil you. the magic for yourself. Right? Oh, by the way, speaking of pickaxes with efficiency... Um, so my unbreaking and efficiency diamond pickaxe that I have, uh, I've had to repair twice now. I have been chewing through some shit with this bad boy. Thanks. Yeah, I've. Well, I got I got a bunch more netherrack to cook, which reminds me we're gonna we're gonna go looking at some stuff in a few minutes. So, um, Jonas, once you get done. Uh, how much? How much more do you have in your inventory to do? Because I know uh, all the coal oh, is still out there. I have there. a bunch, but I can put most of it back. Uh, let me just finish this set of sixty-four blocks, and then, which will take me approximately like a minute. Uh, <laughs> like literally. it's more about controlling his pickaxe than actually <laughs> the pickaxe speed. <laughs> mm, the pickaxe <laughs> hungers. Mm, the pickaxe hungers. <laughs> Zach, oh, fuck, I need more. <laughs> Could you do it again? Just keep going. Just <laughs> yep. keep going. Yep. 
Just okay, you I, just keep mining. I think you want to know the figured out you, how not to do it on future ones, but yeah. You want me to show you the trick? You do it from really far away. <laughs> so see how far away I am right now from like yep. the end of the block? Yeah. And then you can just chew through it because you you learn to calculate the distance. Yep. Oh, so good Lord. I was doing it sort of the opposite way, but it really only becomes a problem when I am right at the end of the bottom row. Okay. Oh, hello. Uh, let, me, Hi. let me just block this up and I am good to go. Nice. No, right. but that would be a good pickaxe name. What's that? Yeah. Sinister. <laughs> Oh, Sinistar, nice. Sinistar. 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 All right, let's go mm -hmm. throw another stone in the floor. Have I mentioned lately how much I hate digging through ocean? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I just wanted to make sure that no one had forgotten that I hate digging through ocean. That's No, that's uh, a fair point. Are you point. at the ocean level? Like, are you trying to dig through water? I am... Yes, I am digging through water successfully. Yeah. It's just annoying as shit. Because I'm Probably. tunneling to a place I want to go to, but there's apparently an ocean between me and it. Uh, question from the noob. Sure. Is there a reason to block diamonds ever? I yes. mean, Faith. I mean, yeah, that's it. Just storage space. Like, okay. So all looking... of the all of the gems, like the uh, gold, silver, all of those can be blocked. And you can unblock them for no cost. So like it's the it's, same amount of that you put in that you're getting out. Yeah. That's what it's I that, also, okay. also to flex on the peasants for not having as much diamonds as you. <laughs> That's also true, yeah. I've seen people that'll make like they'll Dragon literally rooms. Oh yeah, and they'll have like entire like blocks of just like diamonds and emeralds and, and throw lapis in there because it's, you know, pretty blue sapphire y looking and they'll just do it. Just for funsies. Nice. That's always been one of my goals, is to have, like, a treasure room. Where everything has a sparkle. I've made underwater houses out of, uh, out of lapis before. All right, Jonas, you ready? Yep. Okay, follow me. I to remember how to emote, but what is it, B? B. Right. B, okay. yeah. So let's B see. B for bad manners. I can face plant. Oh, good. Did we just face plant simultaneously? Oh, That's look cool. at that. Face planting as a team. <laughs> Nice. I don't think I you can, can emote. Stab yourself in the head. Because I only have like uh, six buttons. Is that the wave? Is the wave? Yep, that's yeah. the one. Okay. I wonder if I. I wonder yeah, if I, I can, can wave emote. Kind of looks that... a little. Uh... Yeah, it looks like you're scratching your back with your sword. This is oh. the wood punch. I'm told. I'm not sure. Emote why that looks is like apparently this. left on the D pad. Is it? Oh. Okay. Yeah. Well, now, now we'll never know. All right, let me make sure I have it set. Toggle there perspective is oh, up. Emote both is clapped at the same time too. Nice. Wait, mob effects. What are what are mob effects? Like the like when you're wearing heads and stuff. Oh, I guess. Oh. Oh. Oh, look! I got emotes. Nice. Whoa. Oh, hey, I just found an emerald next to a diamond node. Which one's... Nice. The, where's the face plant? Which one's the face plant? Um, the one where it... The <laughs> bottom to the right, yeah. That's, that's the, one the face where plant. Really, yep. Perfect. You're going to need that one. Okay. There is uh, plenty of outfits, too. Wait, hold on. Yep. I just So you don't have to it. run around as a basic bitch, Steve. I mean, I like being a basic bitch, Steve. Fine, then run around and be a basic bitch, Steve. I like, yeah, I'm going to do it. Hey, I, I got a face plant. You? Yep. Did I do it? Oh, man, you did. Yes. Yay! Yeah, the thing you have to watch is, you know the little version of you in the top left corner? Uh, oh. At least I assume. Oh, you get that yeah, I, Xbox I see it up there. Yeah. How do you huh. switch to third person view? Is there a key for that? F5. There's an five. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna say it's one of the F keys because I constantly hit it on my uh, mouse. Okay. On and on the D pad, it's up. Yourself. I gotcha. Neat. All right, you ready? Yep. All right, come with me. Whoa. Okay. Emerald there are more City. than two views. Yes. 
Yes, there are three views. <laughs> okay. And there are three my pants. views. Hey, wait, where are you oh, guys going? Infinity view. Oh, yeah, wow, I was following the wrong diamond clad. Uh, I'm going to chop trees, because that's what I said I was doing today. Okay, go enjoy cheese. Now, Jonas, uh, a while back, like weeks ago, it feels like now, you asked me Ooh. for something. What was it that you asked me I for? What is. what is it, Jonas? Uh, is there an underwater way into our base? Come with me. Wee. To the underwater. Oh, 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 oh. Now there are <laughs> there are steps down here, and oh, that's so cool. There's a magic waterfall wall. Yes, so you I can, strongly endorse this. So you can come through here, walk on through. Now, I have Depth Strider too, so it's a lot easier for me to maneuver through water. Not than me. I also have that. Oh, I nice. the correct set of equipment. Very uh, nice. Two. Let me see here. Yeah, mine's Depth Strider are... 3. Ooh. Ooh, you have three. Very nice. So Weird you're actually right? maxed out. <laughs> so yeah, so now we come this up here. so cool. And then here we are. And, and then I fall immediately into this hole. No, don't worry about the <laughs> hole. That's got a ladder. You won't fall into it. Oh, really? Or if you do, you can climb back out. Yeah, exactly. That's the oh. that's the ladder back oh, down to the mine. That's the ladder down to our mole to tunnels. That's right. Now, nice. if you look out here, I cleaned out that there used to be... Remember, there was the hill here that I terraformed. Well, I've taken it all the way down to like the base level. So we can see all the way out, and we can see the sand dune hills in the distance there. That is very cool. I can't see that because my particular uh, RTX pack handles glass kind of poorly. But don't worry, can you can on your screen. You, gotcha. Don't worry, you'll definitely still be able to see the drowned. Oh <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Drowned will occasionally walk through that. here, but there you can see the barn. There's the pathway going out there. Um, and then like the, the, the land that it's sitting on top of. So yeah, like this is, this was one of my little labors of love. I thought you would appreciate this. And I, it was a really fun project for me to work on earlier this week. This is exciting. Thank That's you. Um, cool. Thank you for showing me. Absolutely. I now mean, I there's... love that these waterfall things work like this, by the way, I've seen it on other streams, uh, but had never gotten to actually like see one in person. Uh, so, and I love that that works that way. So there's so there's there's some magic to it that I had to do. Um, so on this side, this is all just regular stone blocks. Okay. On this side over here in the water, there's actually these are stairs here and here, and then in the bottom here, um, I had it empty when I first did it, so that like the stairs were here and the water would flow down into this hole. And then mm -hmm. after I made sure that the water was in place and the waterfall was like stable, I put in um, stone bottom slabs. So now it's just all set up to where um, the water flows in here and it just stays here. And then that we can cool. just walk right out, out here and then there we are. We it produces have some really wild effects uh, in what you would call it. Um, in RTX. Yeah, I'm going to post some photos in the Discord. I can only imagine, man. This is You should post them in the public is... channel, in the in the public Minecraft channel so everybody can see them. Yes, okay. do it. Also, I just watched It is weird to watch the bamboo grow in real time. Right. Oh like, yeah. I had to look over and it was just like pop and I was like, "Oh, okay." Yeah, yeah, right. That happened as I was chopping them, like the one next to it was yeah. growing and I'm like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> All right, so now, um, so I'm down here by the underwater uh, entrance, and if Coming I go back. over here, Whee. I go up, and then here's the like the under the steps entrance that's been here for a little while now, expanded slightly, cleaned out. Um, and you can see I've put in lanterns here. I th I don't know if the lanterns were here last time I streamed. Um, now, if I go keep going down, this um, this scaffolding actually goes all the way down into the mole tunnels. So we'll get down here, and here we are. And you can see when we get down here, again, lanterns, and a couple of torches here, 
we walk through this area, and when we get here, we are right behind the stairs to the main stairwell to the the, the mole tunnel. Nice. So, we can, so we can actually take the scaffolding down and then just go right into the mole tunnels. I was wondering if we could do that. Nice. We sure That's can. Really cool. I am down in the tunnels, tunneling. So my moly things. Now I'm going to go back up the scaffolding because there's one last thing that I've been working on. It's not quite done yet, but this is my, this is actually, I think like the most, it like, it's not difficult by any means, but I think it is the most thought through thing that we have so far. So there's it's our underwater pretty. entrance here. This is going to be our main nether portal hub. Oh, 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 oh. So if we come through here, we have a large nether know. portal that's going to be set up over here. We've got some of those shroom lights in the floor here. Um, just to keep everything well lit. That. And then the columns on the side. Like, Elena, I, I, I just love the, what you did with those. So I totally am going to keep doing that. I like it. It it. It's good for lighting and it looks cool to me. So I'm glad you. I I saw what you did because I was up in there earlier and I like it. Yeah. So, so I went. But go ahead. Sorry, go ahead. I was just gonna ask here by the entrance where I'm looking. Um, what are these? What do these look like to you? I I want to get a sense of this on stream because it looks it like looks they're like, little faces. They are it little looks like faces. Skeleton faces to me. They're skeleton faces. Yeah. So there are regular. So if you look around, you can see these are regular nether brick blocks that are in the mm -hmm. floor and the walls. The ones up here, these are chiseled nether brick blocks. Okay. You see that occasionally in stand, sandstone from like sand, uh, the temp, desert temples too. So yes, you'll, you'll see that in a couple different. Uh, mediums gotcha. yep sandstone okay. will do it um cool. there's regular stone that you can do chiseled that has different things on it i think the i think the 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 regular stone has like a creeper face on it interesting but yeah um so there are a few materials like elena said there are a few materials that you can do in a chiseled form so i thought that that would just be a neat little like little something extra to add to it just to give it that extra sense of grandeur absolutely so we're going to have a, a little area here. Um, we're probably going to put like, uh, I'm probably about to make a, an ender chest to put in here. Um, just so we have one, you know, near the main portal. Um, cause we have and one on the folks who, sorry, go ahead. Oh, I was just going to say, so we'll, we'll have one on both sides of the nether portal. So we'll have one coming and going to the nether. Cool. Now, for those of us who are newer to Minecraft, like me, uh, the Ender uh, chest is the one that has a shared, essentially a shared uh, inventory that you can access from any of multiple Ender chests. Is that right? That's right. Yeah. It's and it's, it's essentially a pocket dimension. You. Right. So, oh, what's... so if we're on the same server, it will have a different inventory for me than for Zach. That's yes. right. Like, if you go look in the Ender chest in the enchanting room, I'm not sure what's in yours but you will not see the extra diamond pick and diamond boots that are in mine. Gotcha. So anything that's Probably in your, nothing in mine then. so anything that's in your ender chest is in all of your ender chests, but only your ender chests. So gotcha. it's, it's, that's it's, it's, cool. it's, it's essentially like your own personal TARDIS. <laughs> so I have this X'd off right now. Cause what I want to do is, um, I'm going to go take the other one and deactivate it because um, I got me a bucket of water. Um, so I'm going to go deactivate that portal and then light this one up and see if our main portals actually link up. I'm really hoping that they do because uh, I'm... I feel like they're close enough. but They, they are. They definitely are close enough for that. Yeah, they they are. I just I always worry because like I like I'm pretty good at getting portals to link properly. Oh, that reminds me. I have another portal to show everyone. So so let's get the portals working and then we'll go through the Nether to our adventure. We'll go on an adventure. 
as a heads up, you are rubber banding a little bit for me. So hopefully we don't have the realm is uh, lagging. Of, yeah. Okay. Hopefully yeah, we realm. don't have a repeat of the last time around. Oh god, I hope not. Um all right. be very crabby. Alright, let's go in here. Let's douse this thing. Oh, that's painful. Why isn't it dousing? Because it's you try it again. No, like just put the water down again. I tried. How do you break another? Do you just mine a block out of it? I thought you could. I thought you could do both, but yeah, I'll I'll just I'll mine the top obsidian out of this. Water is spreading very slowly, but. Uh, I'm I'm assuming that you're not able to eat because I can I hear you continuously eating. <laughs> Actually, no. Ironically, I am successfully eating. I just finished. Um, there's an achievement, and I apologize for just making eating noises on your stream. <laughs> no, I mean it's fine. Like, <laughs> like I I I think it's hysterical. For... Honestly, <laughs> there's an achievement for surviving on only dried kelp for three days. And oh I saw my this god! And I was like, that seems entirely doable. Um, but the the thing about kelp is that it does not fulfill a lot of your hunger, as it turns sure out. Sure doesn't. So you have to eat approximately one million of it in a row uh, if you find yourself down to like uh, three filled hunger bars, which is where I was. All right, so let's get the flint. I'm just going to follow Zach. Jonas was just really hungry and <laughs> only eating like kale. Got right. it. Huh. Just ate like nine pounds of nori, straight seaweed. Straight up seaweed. All right. Um. Oh shit! You know what I need to do? No, I am gonna make another ender chest, and I'm gonna put this down here, and I'm gonna put my shit in it because I don't, I don't, I don't trust anything, and I don't want to die. I don't want to just drop me into lava. Like, Seems reasonable. All right. Let's see. There's only seven in there. Oh hey, uh, mole! If you if you are looking for something to do, I know you're on a tunneling mission right now. Um, but if you are looking for something to do, uh, we are dangerously low on obsidian, and I would be ever so grateful if we could get more at some point. I have a massive section of lava that I had just dead ended to uh, dead ended into at the end of the eastern tunnel. I don't know if you had extended that, but if not, um, that might be a missing place to make a whole bunch of obsidian. Yeah, whatever we can do, I would I would be very, very grateful for. There is a ton of obsidian around. I just probably need to like do it. I just I just make a ton of obsidian and then walk away from it all the time. That's no, that's totally fair. Straight like, up, if you let me know where some of those are, I would be more than happy to uh, mine some of that. I mean, the one I'm at, right, the second is kind of far away, but I'll throw it in the thing just because I'm staring at it right now. All right, I am cool. taking off. I am stripping, y'all. <laughs> You're going through? Well, well. Uh, and that one, Jonas, is uh, if you walk down the stairs and go to a thousand and then turn left. There might be more even before that at that left turn because okay. I've been just going through, but oh my goodness, Realms, what are you doing? Yeah, it's being hella laggy for me right now. You know that thing where it like, feels like it doesn't mind the block I'm on? Yeah, it's doing that for every block. Yeah, same. Yeah. All right. I just watched Zach mine a couple of torches that did not appear for like 30 whole seconds. All right, are y'all ready? Let's see if Going this through. ready. Let's see if this works. Up, oh, up! Oh. Is it actually gonna move? Am I going to the Nether? No. I ate it. I ate the entire Nether. <laughs> Folks, we have reconnected our main portal. Nice. Nice. Now go back through it and just confirm. Yeah, that's a good point. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. 
Big bucks, no whammy. Big bucks, no whammy. Yay, and I am I here? Oh, hallelujah. We have new nether portal. That's beautiful. Look at all of those sparklies. So many sparklies. Like we got, we got, <laughs> it's like discount sparkly warehouse over here. I got this sparkly, that sparkly, <laughs> even stuff I just made up. How can I make these prices any lower? <laughs> Come see me, the guy at the sparkly place. No, I want my spoon. All right, let's see. If you're going to be in the sparkly place, I'm going to have to bring diamonds over there. Ooh. <laughs> Although obsidian is really sparkly in ray tracing, so I guess it's acceptable. It's, it is extremely sparkly in ray tracing. It is. Like, I saw, I I saw a lollipop block of screenshots. I diamond is sparkly in ray tracing. We can find out. Ooh, Hold shit. That <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> this is going to be fantastic. How many diamonds do I need to make a block? Nine. 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 Okay. It's not like we don't have them. Yes. I think we're up to five stacks. Oh, well, I'm dumb. I'm moving that ender chest. Hold on. I got to go get a silky. <laughs> I'm glad you're moving it. It's off by one and it's going to, I'm, I'm going to die. If I did all of this and the, the ender chest is off by one. So I can, just to confirm before I do this. I can place a block of diamond and mine it back and get a block of diamond back. There is no loss involved. Correct. Correct. Okay. Uh, let's see. We're, let's place this in sunlight. Ooh, okay. And even, and even if you do, do lose it for whatever reason, I'm pretty sure nine diamonds are a drop in the bucket at this point. Accurate. I'm not going to be worried. If uh, I grabbed diamonds. 18 and made two blocks, but honestly, these are not sparkly at all. This is really disappointing. Aww. Aww. Hold Disappointed. On. Hold on, I have a yeah, thing. I did it again because they don't have a mining. Oh no, the mining animation was just thirty seconds later. That's oh, what buddy. happened there. Um, you're not so showing Minecraft, a... Zach. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, okay. I'm just doing all kinds of fails over here. Don't worry about me. It's There's fine. a uh, a divot in the wall uh, here that. Uh, we will need some stone to replace because right. the mining animation did not happen. That's I understand that's... those feels. That's what's happening to me right now. Minecraft, Mojang, Microsoft, what are you doing? Whoever you are. I don't know. Whichever one of you is responsible for this. There. Just... Is, it, is that better? Yes. Perfect. Yeah, as soon as you put it down, I was like, hmm. I'm gonna move that if you don't. Yeah, no, I, <laughs> I was gonna move that. So what's nice is like while things can potentially come through the portal, like I know eventually they won't because we'll have the portal on the far side blocked off. But I mean, we don't have a lot of like stuff in that area right now anyway because it's like bottom slab and stuff rent like it spawns far away. But this is all bottom slab. Then we have stairs, and then this is all lit up up here. So. This room is secure, which is nice. Um, actually, I'm going to come back in here and do some uh, some soul torches. Um, yeah. Oh, hello. Welcome back. All right. There's so no let wood me... in the nether, Chris. <laughs> See how much wood I got? No, I'm just picking on you, honestly. And honestly, I, I needed to get I needed to get those potots out of my nether, nether chest. You needed to get those potatoes out of your nethers? I hear that. Oh, but my. That's, you know, a problem we all have from time to time. <laughs> who who among sure. us? <laughs> I'm pretty sure the uh, the term for that is a yeast infection. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. Okay. Well, that took a turn. Boy. Those are not fun for wow. you guys, from what I know. Are those fun for anyone? I mean, no, but they're especially not fun for you guys, for what I know. Huh. Well, today's stream has already taken a turn. <laughs> Fantastic. Just one more service we offer. Ah, there you go. Indeed. Indeed. It's all about providing quality services for your viewers. That's true. 
Okay, let's see. What have I got? All right, I'm good. I need to go grab a couple more. This wait, where are the soul torches? Are they still in the dump chest? Yes. Yes. Are they? Yes, the lowest one. In the middle, on the right side. Oh, oh, oh. They were they were covered by the 20. I didn't see the tiny flame. It's a, it is a small, not a tall. All right, let's go. And I'll eventually clean the rest of this up, but... You guys, we have such a pretty portal room now. We do. Uh, I worry about that being enough light, but I'm also... Not to, no, you know what? Oh, I just got an idea. I'll be honest, it is a little bit dark in there in RTX for what it's worth. RTX is a little bit darker in general, so I think it's safe yeah. still. Uh, let's see, what was I? Oh no, I know what I'm doing. Uh, Do you? Uh, no, you really? no. Oh man. <laughs> oh, I forgot I have an ender chest in there now. Oh god just... damn it! Where did I leave my ender chest? I ate it. How many times have we told you to stop eating the equipment? That's how you no. that that's how you that's how you lose equipment privileges. I'm oh. gonna have to. I think I might have to make another ender chest because I think I was put it down in the middle of all that lag. So yeah, mm. oh, no. might have gone off. Mm, no, like lag. I mean, it's it's probably somewhere, but <laughs> but who where, knows where? <laughs> where if it's not in the the big diamond patch that I did, I'm not sure where it's gonna be. Who can Does say anymore? Come... Who can say? Random outdents. I too am a random outdent. Does that mean you're an is extra anybody friend? else? This is going to be extremely narrow casting, and I'm betting the answer is no. Did anybody else participate in Identica? It was like a circa 2009 or 10 theoretical like open source Twitter alternative. Nope. And instead of tweets, uh, they had dents. No. Uh, which I, was, you know, as exactly as successful as you would expect. I didn't do that, but I did do Diaspora, the Facebook alternative. Oh, oh yes. That one still technically exists, at least as of last year. I remember seeing somebody's page. Yeah, it exists. I mean, you know, doesn't do much, <laughs> but it's, it's In the still way there. That the, the internet continues to exist whether you want it to or not. Whether you want it to or not. <laughs> it exists in the same way MySpace exists? Does that still that exist? seems right. It does still exist. Oh, it it does. It does. Just Well, the f it sort of exists again. They decided to make it about bands. Well, that's probably Which, about time because it's all that it's remains. All, all that we used it for. All right. If I was an ender chest, where would I be? Cause I wanna put diamonds in my ender chest. Honestly, um, MySpace should have been the first sign that auto playing videos and music was not a good <laughs> idea on the internet. What? Yeah. yeah, but who learned anything from MySpace? Hey, Man, Chris. somewhere in a post doc is. Sorry, go ahead. No, I was gonna say, can't. I wish you could post like I wish you could place doors in like the middle of blocks. Like I hate That'd that it's one. Convenient. I hate they that I it's learned an arrow is not a potato. No. So I, I should not try and plant an arrow. You should not plant an arrow. You should also not try to eat an arrow. Um I took an arrow to the tree. Oh my god. Oh. Right on you. <laughs> Technically. Wow. <laughs> I'm I'm you could be a mole like you. <sighs> <laughs> Ouch. Hey Chris, when you get a minute, can you make me a shield and an ender chest and stick them in a chest somewhere? The chest by my bed would be probably the best one. Because I'm probably gonna have to come back for that. Alright, let's go let's go on an adventure. Alright. Wait, no. Haha. -ha. 
I don't have to go that way anymore. I am going to tear down that old nether portal building, though. Don't do it. Don't? You won't do it. Oh, no, I will do it. So, Elon, hypothetically speaking, you said your bed. The purple one in the it's, snuggle chamber. It's the purple one on the... if When you walk in the door, it's the far right. It's the purple one. The only purple one with a single chest next to it. That, so, next okay. to the chest that So, has Zach knows where my bed is. That's because you, you claimed the bed <laughs> next to mine is your bed. So wait, you guys claim okay. beds in the snuggle chamber and oh, I'm, I'm just I'm bed. just a slut and sleeps okay. in everyone's bed, like <laughs> Hey listen, we don't slut shame here. I'm okay with this. I just have a particular bed. You know how particular I can be. I All have right. a particular set of beds. <laughs> like a particular set of skills. Also Does it have a weighted um, blanket in it? Also, I yes. went through, and there's still a stretch here that does not have slab, but I got really tired of zombie pigmen spawning in here, so the rest of this is all slab now, so this is only two and a half blocks tall. Nice. Yep. Tired of zombie pigmen. Whatever did they do to you? They just look at me funny. Um, also, um... So I'm just going to I'm just going to go ahead and say it cuz it's it's going to be a thing at some point. I'm probably going to redo the Nether tunnels. How dare? Obviously which is a lot of sticks in there. Which Isn't is Mo working on that? Well, Mo's working on the first area. Um but oh no, I want to go to the new one. But uh I'm I'm I don't like that they're even now. I don't like it and I don't know why I did them even to begin with. Oh, so, so you're what, just going to widen it? No, I'm going to narrow it. Oh, okay. That'll let me reclaim a lot of this cobble, which will be good. Anything in here? Oh, look, a fire boy. We are going to have more coal than anybody's body has room for. Amazing. All right, so uh, coming down here. So this is norm This is where we go to the, the portal for the double village, and there's the second nether fortress back there the close one I've made a new hallway here so when we come down this hallway uh, we come down just a, a smidge and we come over here and I wish Tom was here tonight I know I know he's not here tonight because it's wrestling night there we go zoop 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 Ooh, boy, the lag um, is real. How much? Where is our obsidian, and how much of it do we have left? Uh, it's it's in the second room, in the gym's room, and not much, not much at all. Oh, once I, I see get it. Through the um, once I get through this backlog of coal, uh, I can potentially go get some more. All right, so <laughs> good. So we have a smaller uh, we have a smaller Nether portal here. Okay, because this is this is a way station. This is not a, a primary portal. Um, however, if we turn and look, you see we don't have the normal like front door right here like we do with the other portals, uh, portal rooms. So we have the door at the other end here. But what I want to show you is we're going to come down these steps here, and we have a small corridor, and this corridor leads up to the area where Tom has been working on his. Um, his his trading post. Ooh. So we now have a direct connection to the trading post. Nice. Um, once we get all the grass out of here and we replace it with something else, um, probably like like I'm I'm actually digging the stone brick, and we have like enough of it to to get started. Um, but once we get all the, once he gets all this done and we replace this grass nothing will be able to spawn in here which will be nice nice and what's what's also nice is bless you thank you she it was it was incredibly loud she's downstairs <laughs> uh what's nice is because of the way everything's arranged nothing can get in or out of here unless we want it to so we actually have a completely safe um, 
path to the um, the trading post from the portal hub here. Nice. And then if we do want to go um, out into the world, we can go out like we normally do. And there's, you can see there's the, the hub house with our corridor. And then we'll just go back inside. And I put a little, I put a little block here just so, you know, Ooh, I heard that. There's a thunderstorm of brewing. Um, but anyway, I put a, I put a, a stair block here to, to kind of block that path. I might actually just move that up one. So it's not, not like immediately in the way. No, I'm just laying out as much of this coal at once as I can. And it's really making me appreciate just how far, how much Elena tunnels. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. There we go. You don't really think about how much 128 blocks of coal is until you've just laid it all out in end to end. <laughs> Like room enveloping block. Yeah, is it still all out, or did you did you do it already? Uh, no, I've still got it out, and I'm still actually adding the last few of that 128. He's coming back. Ooh, give me a minute. I want to come see this. I want to come see the coal <laughs> that now just owns our fucking like main room up there. I mean, I'm keeping it between a few chests. Um. So that, like, I don't lose track of where the room ends. But, yeah. I I might be bringing more back. Because I need to come back <laughs> to get my enter chest. Excellent. I mean, I can add to this, but I will wind up just accidentally uh, picking our uh, chests yeah. in the process. No, so I'd fine. best not do that. Um, you're also not obsidian. getting your enter chest until uh, we get more obsidian. So. How much more obsidian? There's only seven in the... How many do we need? Eight. Eight? Right. I actually, I have a couple if you want to give me... Wait, why don't you go steal some from the uh, the old portal? The old portal has enough. True, I'm, I'm gathering some right now. Okay. Let's see if I can find any obsidian between where I am and home. Wow. Like, I gotta tell you, I'm... Whoa! Good gravy! Oh boy! I told you that, the thunder is ridiculous in this game. It sure is. All right, so I listen. I mean, I know that I'm biased, but I gotta tell you, like, I'm, I'm, I'm digging this like pretty hard. It's it's nice looking. It's pretty cool. Thanks. Jesus. <laughs> it's weird that you can hear it all the way down there, actually. I yeah. know, it drives me nuts that I should not be able to hear it 50 feet under the world, but I can. Holy oh, shit, that's, yeah, that's a lot of coal. Yeah, I'm still in the process of placing... Uh, to do, to do, to do, to do. I decided to go for a third stack of 64 all at the same time. Sure, what the uh, hell, why see not? How much of that I can... That's amazing. My nether brick is cooking real good. Um, you know, since it's thundering, I might actually go to bed real quick just to clear this up before I go traveling. I don't want to get struck by lightning. Yeah, that's fair. Give me one sec. I'm okay. in kind of water. No, it's not going to work very well. That's no, fair. No, my bed is not going to work on water. Mm. <laughs> is it a water bed? If you had a water bed, jeez. Um, it is not a water bed. Let me I tell you guys, it's... by the way, the honeysuckle smell of this candle is just delightful. Mm, honeysuckle is on my list of very favorite smells along with wisteria. Well, to be fair the honeysuckle, you are a bear like me. This is true. Um... I got string. <gasps> you did... No, cats, sit down. No running away. Good kitties. 
Jonas and his seven cats. <laughs> Two cats and a dog. He has really. six cats. He wishes he had infinity cats. <laughs> All right, let's. Cat is too many cats. Oh, There's I got an achievement number. for receiving a gift from a tamed cat in the morning. Nice. Yeah, I got mine stealing a gift from Zach from Kitterino at one point. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Oh, can you get gifts from other people's tamed cats? They no. throw it at their feet. Yes. Sure can. They oh, throw it at okay. their feet, and like Holy... so if you sleep near them. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to interrupt you. It's just that 3, 6, 7 times 64 is 448 plus 40. So even after all the mining I've done, there's 488 more, <laughs> more coal to mine. Yeah. Uh, phenomenal. I love yeah. it. Uh, at some point, I will need to learn how to repair an enchanted diamond pickaxe. You take the pickaxe. You want me to show you, you real quick? diamond and you put it on that anvil. Okay, and that's and it. it. Yeah. Yeah, and that's I have literally to it. Experience to do that, right? Yep. Okay. Yeah, you have to have some, but I'm pretty sure you're gonna from all the mining you're doing right now. Oh yeah, no, I'm at 38 now. I, like, it's not oh. like I'm low on experience. Yeah, you could but... enchant like a whole set of armor practically at this point. Yeah, it's only gonna take you a couple of levels to repair that thing. Yeah. Cool. Like with fine. with mine, I'm mine has efficiency three and unbreaking three, and the second time that I repaired it, it cost me three diamonds. And four levels. That's it. Gotcha. Okay, so it does take multiple diamonds, though. You can use just one, and it'll do a chunk. Each diamond does a chunk of gotcha. health. Gotcha. Okay. So you can kind of play around, and, like, I tend to not fully repair mine, because the... Then there's always some Yeah, amount you're wasting of wastage. a part of a diamond. So yep. I tend to just put one in, unless I've, like, really, like chunked mine down to orange or something but when yep. mine starts getting that like yellowy green i'm like okay and throw a diamond in and that's where i'm getting to yeah put a bird on it so uh and yeah, does it I, cost I, extra to name the thing it does cost yeah. one level to name it yes okay but it is it, it is merely one level oh yes no that's worth it i was just curious so show you what it's going to cost, what the end result is going to be before okay. you actually commit to it. Yeah, yeah and like be careful. You. Be careful because we are in realms, and realms has filters. So, for example, ah. I went to go rename oh, no. a stone hoe and just call it hose, and it tried to censor it. <laughs> so I can't actually name our hose hose. Oh. Gardening implements. Actually, I called it Farmima Jigs. <laughs> so there's a box. I, yeah, you did. I like that better. There's a box. I like that a lot better. There's a box for. Um, there's a box for shovels, and pickaxes, and axes, and Farmima Jigs. I approve. Not that I have to, but I do approve. All right. Time to pull things out of the other ender chest. Did I put my? I couldn't have put my ender chest in my ender chest. That's dumb, Elon. <laughs> Stop asking dumb questions. That's how I you get. That's managed how you to get get you enough. I did manage to get enough uh, obsidian to make your ender chest. By the way, so. you're the best husband. Aww, I'm really feeling the love today. You know, after we talked about yeast infections. You know. <laughs> All right, so put more coal in, put more redstone in, make Jonas feel like the task never ends. Wait, was that you who just ran in there? <laughs> yes, it was. Excellent. Listen, uh, if... Fine, you, all you're doing is giving me free experience. You're welcome. You don't mind me uh, not getting more uh, obsidian. This is all fine. That's no, fine. I'm, well... I'm actually grabbing the obsidian from this portal, so we're, we're going to have a few more pieces. That I'm going to hoard, but, you know, we'll have them anyway. I grabbed two pieces on my way back because I was told that I needed one, so. I figured so I'd bring one for me. you're overachieving and... or contrary. It can be both. They're not mutually exclusive. Honestly, 
Yeah, honestly, that's like a lifestyle. That's a way of life. I mean, really, like who, again, with this group, who among us? <laughs> Contrary is, uh, is kind of, yeah, very me. No, it's not. <laughs> I'm working on it. Don't look at, don't give me that expression. God. <laughs> don't look at him in that tone of voice. <laughs> all right, Apple. I can't carry all of the coal at once. <laughs> no, There's you only can't. so much. Because it will just overflow. Uh, it will overflow the entire room we have there and then quite a lot more. If I tried to do it all at once. Quite a whole right. lot more. That was forced. It was. That was that was that was very that was forced. Nice. Just like that. Yes. Alright, put the cat C D in the dump chest. The cat Chop CD? the bamboo. We already have one in the jukebox, so you can kick it out and play it if you wanna hear the cat song. I have so many questions. So Wait, there's a there's an anvil up there, isn't there? And I went all the there's way. There's an anvil there. in the enchanting room. Yes. Um, there's an anvil outside of the enchanting room, also. Yes, there is. <laughs> there are two. Anyway, I've seen one. <laughs> there are six anvils outside, and they all want sun chips. <laughs> anvil room when? <laughs> anvil room when? I'll make I'll make a room that like on the wall is just like a bunch of nether. Um, brick blocks in the shape of an anvil so that we know for sure that it's the anvil room. I'm, yep. Only if you can make it big enough to where you can put a um, picture frame on it with an anvil on it. In Done. the anvil. Done. And name the anvil anvil. And name the <laughs> anvil anvil. <laughs> Why not both? <laughs> Oh my god. Okay. Um hey uh hey lollipop. Uh this is no longer my problem. <laughs> Love you, bye. I have decimated the old portal in in the, the, the room containing it. He's ruined the nicety of the village, so he's giving you work to do for later. Oh hello skeleton that I don't have a shield. Excuse me, let me run away and go get my shield before I deal with you. Shields. Huh. Who needs a shield? Me. Oh. Well, okay, get a shield then. Why don't where's your shield? It's on me now. Yep. Can confirm. Oh, Jesus yeah. Christ. The wandering trader just keeps like spawning further and further up the the side of this mountain. <laughs> Watch out, there's a skeleton who wants to shoot you, but he's drowning. Never oh, mind. is it? <laughs> Wait, where is he? He's he's down there. He did. Oh yeah. He he went. He's going down into the down. -ness. Oh yeah, yeah. I don't do down into the downness. Yes. Wait, can skeletons drown? I don't know. I wasn't about to find out. I didn't know that. that I didn't. Up. Come on, get down with the downness. <laughs> yeah, one of the wandering traders' llamas is wandering around in one of my tunnels, or at least there was one. Lord only knows if it's killed itself by now. Yeah, um, well, you know. Yeah, and you want to know the funny thing about that? Huh. His partner, Lama, is uh, the one one of the ones that we have uh, penned up here, because <laughs> I drug it through the through the tunnel. <laughs> oh, oh, is hey. that why he's down in my tunnel somewhere? Yes. Oh, okay. Whatever. Whatever happened to that one llama? Is it still in the wall? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I haven't retrieved it. I'm not the llama wrangler in this household. <laughs> we have several at this point, apparently. I mean, wouldn't it be like here ish? Heck if I know. Right. You're the I one don't... who buried it. Listen, that Do was I weeks like ago. A... Do I look like a llama? <laughs> Wait, you know, I thought it was closer to this level. Person? Mm -hmm. No, it was like, it was like Can down around it? here. By the way, you can't uh, hear it. It's likely not there. This oh is God! The, 
space that I accidentally... Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's fine. Sorry. Oh, this is so pretty. Right? What's I that? love this. This is Ooh. so pretty. I love all the colors out. Yeah. The colors, Duke. The colors. Look. No, just me. I don't know that reference, I'm sorry to say. Oh my god, it was the popsicle commercial from like the nineties. Where like the, uh, the kid keeps I eating the popsicle. I did not have a TV at that time, so that would explain it. Gotcha. Commercials and I didn't get along. Oh, see, I like commercials, but I'm that weirdo. God damn it, why am I not in marketing? I'm in the wrong business. <laughs> do uh -huh. not do not Echo tell it do not tell Lollipop that I have all the obsidian that I'm just hoarding in my inner chest. Hey Lollipop. God I I I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you guys, we're all here together. We can actually all go in the snuggle chamber together for once. Like a family. As he closes the door in my face. I didn't close the door <laughs> in your face. The redstone mechanism closed the door in your face. You activated the redstone mechanism? Well, that's only because I walked in to go to bed. Do we need to talk about the fact that he just said we can all sleep in the snuggle chamber together like a family? <laughs> Like, are we just going to gloss over that? I mean... I let that one go, honestly. I don't see anything strange. Oh my god, there's so much redstone. There's so much redstone. The one who brought it. Well, yeah, but it's different when you see it all laid out versus when it's just in a stack in your inventory. Right. right. I can I get just... a, a stack of coal on this as well. Although it will hide the pretty colors, but I'm about to vacuum them up anyway. Goodbye, pretty colors. Yeah, I just help you out, and I'm gonna ruin this Fortune Three pick while I'm at it. Good. I mean, that's Here's what I'm doing. The gold doing. one. Yeah. Burn the gold one. Do it. I'm, I'm gonna do it on the lapis and not the redstone. Do where it on did, the diamonds. Where did Ooh, the gold yeah, one come on from? I'm hiding the diamonds currently. Sorry. Oh well, I will fix that. Do, do, do. Okay, that's fair. Yeah, just work from the back. Where did the, those uh, gold ones come from? The uh, the the desert temple. I found a different desert temple on my explorations out to like 6,000 X. Oh, sure. There's no, another desert temple? I'm not doing the diamonds with this. Is that the silk touch one? No. It's, it's for gold. It doesn't. Oh, you can't okay. mine. Gold doesn't. With, oh, it's gold. Uh, diamond yeah. with gold, apparently. Oh, Lame. yeah. Okay. Can do coal. Okay. Well, there you go. Yeah, they were in a desert temple somewhere, so I brought them back, because, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, also, I did some quality of life stuff. I mean, um, so, right. so, I put lanterns all through here, and I also went over here, and I got rid of all those torches. And then I moved the door and cleaned all this up a little bit. Because um, we're not really using this anymore. Like, this is really just... You know, it was our first house, but we've outgrown it. We really have. And then I did I did the front a little bit nicer, too. Um, so, you know, yeah. Can you do emeralds with the gold? Probably not. Probably. If you can't uh, do diamonds. I also just vacuumed those up, so... There's a immediately. fortune two diamond pick. If Jonas takes that and shoves it into his diamond pick, it'll make a fortune three. On him. Really? Yes. Mm -hmm. Good to know. Mm -hmm. So feel free to do that at some point. And that'll be that'll be All our right. first Fortune three, won't it? Uh, I think I have a Fortune three lying around somewhere in my ender chest, but I'm not putting it down because then I'll forget to pick it back up. There. Oop. The cat CD. I I knew it. Like ah, uh, that that is. <laughs> okay, so Jonas. Now why the... is it called this? Yeah. Okay. That's the actual track name. So okay. hidden throughout Minecraft, you can find music discs for the soundtrack, and then you can make a jukebox like this one, and you can put the music you can put the music disc in the box. Ooh. And make parrots dance. And you can make parrots dance. But this 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 particular track name is called Cat, which is a very very good song from the soundtrack. The artist. It's pretty uh, it's very Kitterino. Yes, that's correct. 
that's very good use of Kitarino. I'm impressed. Um, so the uh, the artist goes by the name C418. So the letter C418, um, and the soundtrack is just fantastic because you get to hear like the whole soundtrack um, by finding the music discs, and it's just it's great. Cool. So fortune three means that you uh, are mo even more likely to get extras of whatever you're mining. That's more correct. likely to get extras, yes. Cool. Fortune three, I think, is the highest on fortune. Yeah, I think so. Oh shit, I need axes because I need more wood. Like I need a lot of spruce. What? Why do, do I need to? Do... Sorry, go ahead. Why do you need spruce? We have a bunch of dark oak. I need spruce because that's what the bridge is made out of. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. So I'm gonna start working on extending the bridge. I think. So tear down the bridge and make it out of dark oak. No. No. Hard no. Nice. Uh, so if I add the fortune two pickaxe to my own, I can just since they're both enchanted, I can jam them together, get the benefit the of the better, en better enchantment. Yep. And does it uh, also um, repair? Does it also, I assume it also repairs. Yes. Yep. So I should wait until mine is getting low. Gotcha. Yep. Or yeah, I mean yeah. It's kind of one half a dozen one, six of the other, because either you're getting the benefit of the repair or you're getting the benefit of Fortune 3 sooner, so... Gotcha. Sure whichever point. you want. Like, I'm not worried about it either way. Diamonds are not. Gold pick is done. My job here is done. <laughs> did you... You killed it? It did. You blew it up. You, you maniac. Yeah, I found another desert temple in my wanderings, and it had that and something else, and so I was just like, all right, well, so I'll get used on something, maybe. Oh, this is going to be a fucking process. What you doing? Oh. Well, I'm going to extend the bridge, but the problem is I have to put down some kind of solid block before I put down the bottom slab. Because if I put down a bottom slab in water, the water will go over the bottom slab. Gotcha. So, to kind of give said you... You said you need spruce for this? Yeah. Oh my god, I, I am... Gonna bone meal some of this, some of these saplings, Jesus. So Jonas, if you see, Sorry, like, uh, you're gonna bone you some what? I'm gonna bone meal some of the saplings. He's gonna oh. bone him some young saplings. Oh no! Don't no! Oh come on! <laughs> oh, inappropes. <laughs> yes. Anyway, is the bar that we strive to meet on this channel. Uh, I mean, there's, there's, there's a, there's a limit. What is the limit? I, well, I think <laughs> some, young saplings, apparently. somewhere before young saplings. <laughs> that's not very specific, Zach. I'm going to need better rules. Yeah, well, that's, <laughs> that's what you get. You know the rules, and so do I. <sighs> but I wouldn't get this from any other guy. Hey. I'm leaving. We're no strangers <laughs> to love. <laughs> <laughs> wow. wow. <laughs> and Jonas is gone. Jonas is officially here. <laughs> Jonas is done with our shit. <laughs> and I don't not, blame him. J not with a bang, but with a heavy sigh. <laughs> I want you to know that as I came back into the world, I finally got credit for that kelp achievement I've been working on. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> See, we drove you to kelp. That's what we did. Oh, I was dedicated man. to Rick Astley. <laughs> just, I, oh. wow. I just couldn't kelp myself. Rick Astley, we just oh wanted my... to kelp you out. 
<laughs> Zach, and you invited us to wild. this. This is this is entirely my fault. I did this to myself. I did this to myself. I have no one to blame but myself. Really? That's all the dirt that I brought with me? Well, I'm a dummy. I see you have friends. Yeah. Drowned one and drowned two. I wouldn't call them <laughs> friends so much as loose acquaintances. Wait, what? Did you did you see that? And... He teleported through the dirt. Very nice, sir. Oh. Yeah, Nintendo, don't do that kind of stuff to me. What? Wait, what did Nintendo do? Send me an email with just a whole bunch of, uh, like, an advertising email. The oh, about games and DLC was... waiting for you? Well, no, it was just a... It was uh, about the, um... New Super Mario 3D or whatever it is. The, oh, yeah. The, the Bowser's 3D Fury that they, oh. that they mentioned yesterday. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that. That, that, and that. It was just a bunch of meows, and I was like, oh, what kind of game are they going to advertise to me right now? And it was that. And I was like, that's no. That's not very Kidarino of you. That is not very <laughs> Kidarino. Not very Kidarino, Nintendo. Like, I... I, I appreciate that they want they want me to buy their new game, but I can I can deal without Gigantamax Cat Mario. Thanks. <laughs> I mean, like I I missed this entire thing, so I will take your word for it. I wouldn't Amy. say that you missed it, Jonas. I've never been a a big Mario fan. I have to be honest. Mario mm -hmm. sixty four was the one that everybody was like, ah, oh, this is the best game. You have to play this. And I was just like, the camera is bad, and I can't get past it. Also, I didn't have a TV or an N64 of my own, uh, so I could only play it when I went to a friend's house, which probably didn't help. I have some nostalgia for Mario 64, but Mario was not my thing. Like, I just don't... Platforming, jumping and I don't get along. Yep. yep. So, like, I, give me a Zelda uh, game, and I'm interested. But you give me a Mario game, and I'm just like, do you want me to throw the controller? Is that what you want? A Zelda I game. I think it's marginally a fan of the uh, of the Legend of Zelda series. No, um, it's, it's just like branded into your arm. You're only marginally a fan. I'm 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 not familiar. Can you catch me up? What what is this? Well, it is about it's about this. Um, princess and this dude in a green hat named Zeldor. <laughs> Zeldor. Christopher? <laughs> I love it already. Sign me up. Green hat, the green hat guy is Zeldor, I uh, and the princess is Linkus, if I remember correctly. No, she's Lonk. <laughs> oh, right. <I'm> Oi. Usually, usually when you hear the phrase long-suffering sigh, uh, you imagine a hyphen between long and suffering, uh, but that one just sounded like <laughs> long-suffering sigh. Yes. Yes. I, I mean, there's marriage involved. The long-suffering <laughs> is indeed accurate. Damn. Like, ouch. Three That's more like... months and it'll have been five years of Damn. marriage. Yeah, we were supposed to go to Disney this year, remember? Uh -huh. Oh man, yeah, we yeah, we're we're missing Disney pretty hard. I've never been, so we were going to oh. do um Disney cuz we didn't really we never did a honeymoon, so for our 5 year we were going to do uh Disney and just go cuz I've never been and he's been once or twice, once. I've been on the cruise and I've been to Disney. Okay. You've been on the uh, cruise? Uh -huh. Yeah, when he was a oh, kid, and fuck. right after he had E. coli, so he couldn't do half the fun stuff, so um, so we were going to go to Disney, and then uh, COVID, so we're not going to Disney. Yeah, no. I'm, yeah. Is it sleepy time I just saw the chat Super Saiyan Cat Mario. <laughs> God. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we 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 were bummed out because we we had annual passes because I mean we're, you know, I mean, <laughs> y'all know we're we're like an an hour and a half away from the parks, mm -hmm. and so we like we were really bummed this year because when they made the offer to pass holders to cancel their passes, we went ahead and we're like, there's there's no way like there's no point in us paying for this if we can't go like. 
Mm-hmm. It just makes no economical sense. Yeah, no. I was considering. I went. That's why I wanted to go for a five year to see how it was, see how I liked it, see if it would be worth annual passes for me. Because yeah. I'm very picky and things, so I'm like, it, I want to go first before I invest in like annual pass. What'd you so, have? I don't know. I'm I'm disappointed, but we will find something else to do at some point when you know stuff is not crazy. Yeah. I just miss being able to go places and sit down at a restaurant and eat. That's that's the thing that I miss. You miss Mel's. Oh, Jesus Christ. I miss being able to sit inside of Mel's. That's what it is for me. Is like The first two things I want to do once it's plausible to do things again is just go sit in a coffee shop all day. It, there's a, as dumb as this sounds, there's a relatively local Starbucks that I used to live right next to, and even though like I like the idea of supporting local coffee shops and I try to, that Starbucks like was my local coffee shop for a little while. And I just want to go and sit there all day and browse the internet and buy coffees that I don't have to make myself and write and just like chill in a coffee shop. Don't, don't. you're going to write your screenplay. I, want that. I mean, pretend to write. Yeah, sure. That's like, fair. That's usually what I do when I go to coffee shops, but I just want to like, just want to go out yeah, and really... do things that I don't have to make for myself, Sorry. which sounds super. I just want to be able to go grocery shopping again, so I can stop paying. Like the delivery is nice and convenient. Don't get me wrong, but yeah. Well, the only place that delivers where I am, so far as I've been able to tell, is Leiden Whole Foods, which means uh, I'm paying the demon Bezos. Mm. Uh... Uh, and. I feel guilty about that, but also it is the safest way for me to acquire food. I was going to say, right now I'm too interconnected to things to worry about paying the demon Walmart and demon Bezos. Like, that's just what I got to do for now. Yep. Like, I mean, it's, it's goals it's, for later. It sucks, but it'll it be is time for the guillotines after we can all safely guillotine the rich together. Exactly. That's right. That's right. But yeah, like. We're we're mostly doing Walmart now just because I need the cheap prices and they deliver. They do, Instacart yep. does, but down here has pretty good delivery infrastructure, so I should check again. One of my uh the local uh the local grocery chain, which doesn't actually make it a ton better, but Giant Eagle uh had been making noises about doing local delivery. Uh, so I should oh. check to see if they've actually implemented it. Giant Eagle. Now that's the name I haven't heard in a long time. In like six uh, and years. I can tell you're from Ohio because you did pronounce it correctly as Giant Eagle. Uh, <laughs> Giant <laughs> Eagle. Formerly known, formerly known as Finest. No, they were Stop and Shop. <laughs> no, they didn't. They, they bought Finest out though. No, Tops bought Finest. Giant Eagle brought, bought Stop and Shop. Oh man, they we're getting. Tops. We're getting into we're getting into local <laughs> hyper local grocery chain wars here. I There's mean, I don't else from. Sorry, go ahead. I don't know like how it all played out at the end, but I know originally Top Spot Finest and Giant Eagle bought Spot Stop and Shop because Lakewood had both, and they they became the 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 two. And then I never found out if they maybe Giant Eagle bought Tops eventually, but they definitely didn't buy Finest. They bought Tops if anything. Fine, my mom always shopped at Marks anyway. <laughs> See, I'm from Eastern Pennsylvania, so all I get to do here is just like frown sadly and say Lane Co. Uh, and hope uh, that there's one person from Eastern Pennsylvania uh, who knows what I'm talking about. I, I, I got as far as Pittsburgh. All I know about Pennsylvania <laughs> is apparently that there is like a great war of Wawa versus Sheets. That's all uh, I know, and Sheets is better. Uh, false. Oh, Jesus. False. Wawa is better, and that's just the way it is. Wawa doesn't have fried mac and cheese bites. Yeah, well, Sheets doesn't have Wah, wah. Sheets doesn't have the the chocolate banana smoothie that tastes like sex. So no, but neither <laughs> okay, of them have I don't rally, want a so. smoothie that tastes like sex. Thank you. Uh, you you say that you say that until you have the smoothie. I, I can assure say, you, neither you of them want have it. Mally's, and that's where I get my chocolate. So fair. 
yay, hyper local things that almost sweat no one knows what musk. we're talking about. <laughs> it does not smell. It does not taste like sweat and musk. Okay, fine. It Flavor tastes condom? the way sex. What? No. <laughs> Listen, once you have one uh, unintentional encounter with a chocolate condom, you have <laughs> concerns about... I have uh, this sounds like something from them. personal experience, and I'm concerned about you now, Jonas. I just know better than to mess with flavored condoms. Now just well, hear concerned if the, if okay. the word chocolate is in quotes or not. Better yeah. chocolate than <laughs> cherry. It was, it was certainly chocolate flavored, uh, not actual chocolate. That would be a whole different confectioners uh, We're back to the yeast experience. infections. Uh, no, no. He <laughs> said confection. Yeah, <laughs> yeah just, no. Listen, but if you're using a chocolate food. condom, you are definitely <laughs> risking yeast infections. Oh, for God's sake. Listen, if you don't know is a chocolate scented or flavored condom, there's just sudden moments of, oh, <laughs> that was not an expected experience. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cherry is not. I've heard. I've heard horror stories about the cherry ones. Suddenly, oh, no. cold blocks. <laughs> Did you say kumquats? Cold blocks. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> listen, listen. I'm being traumatized <laughs> over here. Uh, it's what are you being? You haven't become an affiliate yet because you'd be demonetized. <laughs> That's not true. My my channel is marked mature. Thank you very much. <laughs> And this is exactly why. <laughs> uh, listen, no. all I'm saying is college is full of important learning experiences that everyone should have once. Just once, though. Oh, well, exactly just one. For certain lessons. Twice, if you like it. Sure. I, you know, it was funny because, um,. I was, you ever, you ever like reattach to a subject, you know, something that you know a little bit about, but you want to go back and, and like remember things or just go reread stuff and you, you find out little facts that you had forgotten about or whatever about the subject. What are you I don't know the premise, but I'm very curious where this is going. So, so there's, there's an episode of the Golden Girls where Dorothy, um, she, like the Jeopardy people are coming to town and she's going to the tryouts to try to get on Jeopardy and Dorothy being a teacher, it's, you know, Jeopardy's her favorite show. She watches it every night. So she's really excited at the opportunity to potentially, you know, to try out and potentially be on Jeopardy. Um, so at one point she's like studying like all of her general knowledge stuff and she has a, she falls asleep. She's like pulling an all nighter. She passes out and she has this dream where she ends up on Jeopardy. And at one point, Merv Griffin, the creator of Jeopardy, known, you know, game show creator, talk show host, etc. Merv Griffin, um, he's actually like there, guest starring in the episode um, as part of the whole Jeopardy dream. And so I'm like, okay, you know, I haven't looked at anything about Merv Griffin for a while. So you go and you're, you're looking on Wikipedia and you end up, you inevitably get to the personal life section of someone's Wikipedia page. <laughs> and so on Merv Griffin's, um, he was, he was, he was like, he played his sexuality very close to the vest. Um, he was, he was married to a woman, um, for a very, very long time. Um, but like, I think, I think up until he died, um, but his whole shtick about his sexuality was he liked to call himself a quarter sexual in so much as that he'll do anything with anybody for a quarter. <laughs> okay. And that's all I could think about is just <laughs> like this whole conversation. That's, that's all I could think about at this point. Now it's all this talk of like flavored condoms and, and going to college and having the experience and trying things at least once. And I'm like, mm, yeah, that's, that's what you do, I guess. In college, I, I, feel no, like I dropped the, it out like two weeks in. <laughs> in college, I feel like the quarter is optional, but definitely appreciated because everybody needs them to do laundry. Listen, man, Accurate. you know, listen, True. you get Accurate. enough, you get enough of those quarters. That's a, that's a bowl of ramen right there. 
No, 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 no. Quarters are for laundry. Yep. Uh, Dollars are for food or pennies. Qu quarters are for laundry. In in the times actually, that I was in college, I actually had my own washer and dryer because it I oh, it worked lucky out. Bastard. Well, I didn't listen. I never went to a real school, so ha jokes on you. I went to community colleges and just had roommates that I lived with in the trailer. That's right. I'm a redneck from a trailer. Hey, I didn't have my own washing and dryer and like until I don't know when we moved in this house. Yeah, I we had one. Well, okay. I'm yeah, I, if you're saying your own because Jason because Jason owned the uh, other washer and dryer. No, I yeah. owned that washer and dryer. Yeah, they were yours. I didn't have them. I wasn't even married to you then. Okay, but were you living together? Yes. Well, then then you had a washer and dryer. Like, you were living together... I was living you, the, with a washer and dryer. Oh, uh, <laughs> you, were, you were in a committed relationship with a washer and a dryer. <laughs> oh, so sin. I mean, again, who among us? See, when I was in college... Um, the dorms that we had were actually just an, an apartment building. Everyone, please and control yourselves. This is so a mature party. Two people, two students, no! a one-bedroom apartment. So uh, we all had apartment-sized kitchens and everything, right? So um, a lot of our friends would just cook enormous amounts of food. So we would just steal each other's oh, food all the time. More good. Whoa. You guys, my friend Gene just raided the, the stream. Hi, Gene. Thank you for the raid. That's amazing. Hello. And hi, Gene. It's an important part of hello. everybody's daily. Uh, and also, hello. <laughs> yeah, no, sorry. That was extremely dumb and not helpful. But hi, Gene. It's good to meet you. So glad you guys didn't raid us like 10 minutes ago. Yes. You would have hated this conversation. <laughs> eh, I don't know. Yeah, we can... Uh... Edit our conversation here. Listen, right. listen. We're the, this is a mature channel. We were discussing mature topics. You know, it's fine. It is what it is. So, how was your stream? Were you uh, were you playing more Porsche tonight? I met Gene because we were we were both playing uh, my time at Porsche for a while. They were playing for time because I was watching it before yours started. <laughs> Yeah, we just we we just basically just wrapped up a conversation about going to college and you know and the things you do. It's and flavored the things condoms. you learn. Say it's, and keywords from that conversation include flavored condoms, <laughs> yeast infection. Uh, we didn't know. We didn't suggest that you try the yeast infection. Okay, that's <laughs> no. Nah. Listen, it's like it's like Chef said on South Park. There's a time and a place for everything, and it's called college. Pretty much. Hadn't heard that one, but honestly, that yeah, that tracks. Man, I might go. I might go chew up that other golden pick, the one with soft touch or silk touch, soft touch. What I does might... a soft touch do? Does it like <laughs> mine the blocks nicer? Yes. Oh it's, God, it's the printer's en going. It's what Endermen do. The oh the, my. The chads oh. have the soft touch. <laughs> You learn you, about, you about the soft touch in college. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. man. I hope Tom understands what he was asking for. Sticks. Sticks? Did he you... said, man, I need a lot of rails. Yes. <laughs> Wait. Wait, what were and you I getting wood for? Me? Yeah. Because we were low. Oh, okay. I need more. Do you do you have any yet? <gasps> Look, there's a turtle. Look at the turtle. Hi, turtle. He had gotten the dark oak. I, I got a bunch of dark oak, and I've got spruce trees growing. All right, well, that's fair. Um, ooh. I'm going to have to make more uh, stone brick slabs, because I, I think we're just about out, and I am not quite to the village yet. But I'm going to run back. Oh, look at that sunset. Look at those colors. Sunset. That's colors. that's that's too pretty not to take a, a screenshot of. I will say I've had more of those moments in Minecraft than I expected. Uh, although I think that's, in my case, largely thanks to the RTX. 
I the RTX certainly does help. Yeah. Um, but yeah, this is there's a lot of pretty stuff. Yes, Gene, it was a very fun conversation and at times awkward. And here we are. <laughs> We had all, right, all the best conversations. We had a we had a we had a couple of awkward turtle moments. It's fine. I'm sure. Uh, we'll by the more. way, I promise to clear this coal out as soon as we all sleep. Liar! You keep saying that. I, I'm in the Listen, nether right now, so if you guys want to sleep, I'm going to sleep. I'm going to bed. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Hi, Bowser. You want to go outside? I'm going outside, buddy. Bowser, oh, he's such oh, a good boy. He is a good boy. Oh, wow, there was some lag on getting into bed that time. He doesn't pee on beanbags, so he is a very good boy. Oh. This is my ranking of animals. <laughs> Do they pee on beanbags? This that boy, determines you, if they're a good boy. You're uh, you you got a pretty low bar this week, don't you? Uh, yeah. You know, sometimes you gotta set the bar low and just not trip over it. E. All right, let's see. I learned that last year. The news. Oh Wait, no, one of my cats got loose. Excuse me, cats, one of, come back. One of my cats got loose. This is unacceptable. Cat <laughs> loose. Some <laughs> somehow that. <laughs> wow, did you did we really just lapse into that? Maybe. I I feel like I feel like you like accidentally letting a cat loose and going after it is very on brand for you, Jonas. That's fair. Oh, cat, get off the deck. Now the cat's on the uh, uh, pressure plate, and apparently that's enough to prevent a door from closing. Thanks for the lurk, Gene. Get some Enjoy food. Enjoy your food. Om nom nom nom. Um, okay, I think... Oh, God. Did the cat get itself trapped outside? Yes, it did. That is Good entirely job, possible. All right, so cat, this is the dog. The worst. No, that cat didn't pee in a bean bag. It can be the second <laughs> okay. worst, but it cannot Touché. be the worst. <laughs> wow. Oh my Look. god! This. <laughs> no, I thought it trapped itself on the other side of the door, but it did not. Okay, so hey, lollipop. At some point, and. Do you mind if I like move this over one and then add another one just to to even this out? He probably doesn't, but he's AFK letting Bowser out. Oh, so that's right. He's letting he the pup out. Care. He's letting the pup out. As the person who's been told that she's the same person as him, I'm gonna say that he doesn't care and he likes even th evening things out. Wait, you've been told that you're the same person as him? We have been for years now called basically the same person. Wow. As evidenced by the part where we went to shit post to each other the exact same thing earlier today. <laughs> yes. Yes, we did. We have Oh god. 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 Now when you say evening things out, do you mean an odd number width so that you have a center or do you mean Yes, hold on. I I will show you what what exactly I mean. But yes, Sorry, I just the, saw Tom say that should be good on the rails. That should be good on the rails. Oh, well, Tom! How many rails I I made him? No, how many? I mean, Holy shit! That's a lot of rails. He said he needed rails, and if you don't he, give a number, I'm gonna saturate <laughs> you with them. He, he said he needed saturate rails. The problem with solutions. Holy coal, Batman! That's that's a lot of rails. That's I see. <laughs> This is that the 9, the 10, 11, 12, 13, 13 and a half stacks. Some people like being railed. Listen, you know, what, whatever, whatever floats your boat. Well, hopefully Tom likes being railed because boy, howdy. Boy, howdy. Did I deliver? Um, oh, you hi. Deliver. Are you here? Are you here hi. to see the thing that I was going to show you? Yes. Okay. Come with me as I, as I place dirt to fill in this water. Oop, that's the back of my head. Now what I was going to say is this little guy right here, I'm going to move this over a couple and then put another one over here so that we have like two and they're centered along where the path, path oh, goes. Oh, hell here. yeah. Yeah, okay. go for it. Okay, cool. 
I just gotta, you know, eventually get more. I need so much spruce. Also, you're you're as you're mentioning that this is uh, needing to be taken down was literally just me. Uh, I just uh, didn't do that. I just kind of put. Oh, I, I got rid of the thing and called it good. I guess we can just the, use that stuff, huh? Use what stuff? The the um the lights and the fencing or the walls that were up for the lanterns by the old um nether portal i i can do words i swear to god i know how to say <laughs> words sometimes don't we have more lanterns anyway well yeah it was it was really the wood that i was concerned about ah uh. Because wood is our, that's our precious resource right now. That's what we don't have a lot of. How do you but, automate wood farming? Can you um, do bedrock? Sexy I, pictures. I would assume something with observers and redstone. But Sexy pictures. Listen. I mean, yeah, but you have to figure out what the wood likes to do that. It's easier just to watch it. Well, what if it's what if it's not into exhibition? It'll be by the oh. time I'm done with it. Oh my god! A lot of shit is happening, y'all. <laughs> For those watching at home, a lot of shit is going on. Frankly, I blame myself. You you should. Yeah. You allowed me on the server. I didn't. I I didn't just allow. I invited you. I specifically invited you to the server. This is true. This is very much my own doing. I was gonna say, and you know Lockhart, so you knew what you were getting into. That's a good point. Uh, I, as the point has been made, y'all have been married for five years now, so <laughs> we're basically the same person. So I've heard. I'm almost done with this call. Oops, sorry, say again. Oh, I'm just mentioning that I'm spanking the cows. It's fine. Nice. He is beating his meat in the barn. With a sword. Called the cow spanker. That's, Mark two. Uh, if that's what he wants to call it, that's, you know what? And that's his business. Is this one also a gold sword? No. Okay. The Cow Spanker Mark II is a diamond sword with looting two, I think. Looting two, looting three, and flame. Fire, fire, or flame, fire, fire aspect. Flame. Yes. Whatever. So it cooks the, the meat. Barbecues. <laughs> looting two. Yes, it's a very I lewd mean, sword. Yes. But only while only while Lollipop is wielding it. Lollipop, the original looter. Lewd or shooter. I appreciated uh, uh, that silence. joke. I was just trying to come up with something clever to respond to it with and failed. So I was <laughs> We opted for awkward silence instead. Yeah. No, I, mm. I did appreciate it for the record. Mm, awkward silence, my favorite. Tasty, tasty Zach silence. feeds on awkward silences. This is actually... Uh, his feeding ground now. That's right. That's 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 actually the real reason why I invited you all here is so that I could wait for the awkward silence and then take full advantage of it. It sustains like, me. But I'm like never silent. That's okay. Lockhart's silent enough sometimes. Alright. I'm mostly silent when I'm sitting in a meeting with opinionated people that ice I don't want to get in the middle of. More ice bear. More <laughs> well, it also doesn't it it also doesn't help, you know, when you're playing, you know, Final Fantasy 14 in said meeting. He would never do that. What? I also would never just walk around our entire base replacing all of the not stone with stone to make it all look cleaner. Oh yeah, no. He, 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 he thank he you told, for your labor. 
I appreciate that one because I was just mining out random coal while Zach was working on the new nether portal earlier. I just like wandered away and was like, okay, the, the coal in the wall because he had like made the uh, space for it, but he hadn't like mined out the coal in the wall. And I was like, nope, this is mine, meow. Hey, Lollipop, you know all that wood that you brought back? Mm -hmm. I just stole it. Love you. All of that wood I brought back. Like the all 45 the or whatever? No, the, the, the spruce. I haven't touched the spruce yet. It's been oh. growing. I haven't I haven't farmed it yet. I, oh, I farmed okay. dark oak. And I was like, if there's any reason, any way that you took that much dark oak, I was going to be like, um... Are you sure you're not just replacing the entire bridge with it? It's like so watching Anchorman. It's like, I'm not even mad. That's amazing. Pretty much. Uh, it is now just about two hours since the stream started. And I have just finished cleaning out uh, the chest. <laughs> oh my god! You just now got done. Well, I guess, yeah. There was a lot of buildup in there. And what I did level come back are in the you? middle of that. Uh, I'm currently, yes, I did use two levels previously, and I'm already back to level 41. Uh, I, actually, no, I used at least three levels. Uh, and I think I started today at 30. Um, uh, <laughs> so do you want to enchant some stuff since you're in your 40s? Uh, I was actually going to, let me... Uh, I can, I can on, only hope then... I can only hope that in, in five years, someone will ask me the same question. <laughs> Fair. Um, actually, I'm going to, for now, just uh, move the uh, pickaxe up to Fortune 3. Uh, I would and do that's that. It's going to cost me seven levels as is. I would still enchant like a piece or two because anything over 30 is basically, I think, cap. Yeah, I would drop yourself okay. under 30 if you could. Yeah, like, I mean, I don't care what you enchant or if you want to enchant something for you, but it 30 is pretty much the the place gotcha. to be. Enchant okay. me, enchant uh, me some, some new shoes. See if you can get Depth Strider 2 or 3 because I need Depth Strider 3. I have... You understand I have no idea how this works. No, it's you okay. You take an item, you put it on the enchanting table with some lapis, and the enchanting table goes, here's what you get. Take it or leave it, sucker. And what sometimes are the you books good for? Uh, books, you can put anything on them. Like, it'll be random what you put on them, but then you can put that on anything. Like, if I get fortune on a book, I can put it on a shovel if that was there was a reason to do that or something. Gotcha. Uh -oh. And Zach, you were looking for Death Strider on what? Uh, on a diamond pair of shoes. I okay. just want Buy some shoes. Buy some shoes. So if I put depth strider on some shoes, or depth strider put... on shoes. So what you do is you take the um, you take a di a pair of diamond boots. So like there's an un Yoink. yeah. Yep, that... I've got those. And grab th at least three lapis. Um, doesn't matter yep. how much you actually grab. Come over to the enchanting table. When you look at that, you put the boots on the one level on the one side the lapis three lapis on the other side and then that should light up the stuff gotcha in the middle. hover over it it'll tell you what you will get and if any of those are what you want you go ahead you select it and it will give you that plus some other random stuff on it probably sometimes gotcha. if you don't well, it seems like to tell you in advance oh you can yes. choose the it tells I you got... one, but it doesn't tell you all of them. So you now, may get something like... else. Right. Now, if you don't like what you're going to get, you can grab either another piece of gear or a book and chant that instead, and that refreshes your roll on the gear, so that you can turn around and try and enchant the boots with Depth Strider that way. Okay. That makes sense. Uh, I think so. Let me... Yeah. What's the thing? Oh, yeah, let's sleep, and then we'll try more of that. Oh, I'm stuck. Hey, you that better watch it. That's really Elena's bed. My stuff. Rude. <clears throat> Boy, that was a... That was a... That was a lot of man in that sandwich. I had, I had Lollipop on one side of me. I had Jonas on the other. That was... Who boy. You might say that it was a mandwich. 
It was indeed a manwich. Was it a tasty, tasty manwich? Mmm, delicious. I mean, we'd all like to think so. Let's see how far I got down here. Oh, not bad, not bad. Uh, I, I'm going to make it to the corner, I think. Or I think you're going to more spruce. Oh, I need so much spruce. Okay. So, if we have a book Thank that you. has Death Strider on it, is it worth using that book to put Death Strider on the... If it has, uh, Depth, the... If it has Death Strider too, I can just then... put it on my boots. Then he can already just put it on his boots, and we don't need it. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. So yeah, I oh, didn't even know we had one. Do we have one? Do we have yes, one? Yes, we do. Sweet. Yes, we have a book of Death Strider Two Flame One. Oh, 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 I'm I'm stealing it, that one. I was gonna say it won't okay. put flame on your boots, but hey, you never know. You never know. This is bedrock. Do. The the All rules right. do. <laughs> the this rules is bedrock. Did... I know nothing. This is bedrock. I could be running around with like flaming shoes in the depths of hell. What does smite do? It's a sword enchant that does sword enchant it's things. More damage to skeletons and on other <laughs> undead. Oh, new combat. Okay, got it. Whereas fire aspect does fire things. Fire Correct. aspect does fire, fire aspects, things. Lights things on fire. There's smite that does things to skeletons and other undead. Uh, and then I think the only other one, like there's sharpening, which is just <laughs> more straight damage. <laughs> and then I think there's bane of anthropods, which is bugs. So spiders. Spiders, spiders I think. Are the spiders and cave spiders. And yeah. I th and silverfish, maybe. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. I think silverfish are bugs, but. Don't ask me what I mean, Minecraft thinks they are. Right. In in real life, they're arthropods for sure. <laughs> but this is Minecraft. Listen, you're asking a this lot of Minecraft nasty. science. <laughs> Caught in a landslide made of coal. The first thing <laughs> uh, Minecraft science asks you to do is punch a tree with your bare fist. That's right. And from no, there, it asks me to turn around and grab the chest nearby because I start with chest. Well, I'm you know what? Duck. Ultimate survival. When, yeah, no. yeah, you and your bedrock. That's right. I mean, you can have a starter chest and bedrock. Well, we didn't. No. And if we did, we probably would have lost it to Trident that got led in our house. Listen. <laughs> That was like over a sprint ago. It doesn't count. <laughs> over a sprint ago. That's your excuse for everything. Right. Well, now I have a looter's blade. Uh, and Ooh. I am back to 30. Awesome. Fire aspect one, looting two, smite three. Uh, ooh, nice. Ooh. Yeah, not a bad build. Yeah, so basically hey there, anytime you get significantly over 30, it's good to like enchant a piece or two, just because that way if something happens and you do die, you're not losing. Gotcha, I see what like, you're saying. A like you've at least done something with your XP. If you sit on 40 yep. and you die, you're like, oh man, if you die at like 27, you're like, eh. Gotcha. I can't do anything with that anyways. I mean, you can because you can repair things, but you know what I mean. So oh. are you just not able to enchant under 30? You can. You can just only do the lesser enchants. And, I mean, gotcha. who wants to do the lesser enchants when you can save up and do the bigger ones? Makes sense. I am literally just out running around looking for a pig to smite. All right, now I need diamonds. Uh, we have Good news. Packs. Do we have diamonds? N no. I no. Them all on. We have no diamonds. Oh no! I need more levels. Dang. Get some levels. Get some levels. If only, if only you had been around earlier. There was all this coal to mine. Son of a bitch. The uh, the shoes the shoes thing. The let's get some shoes. What's that from? I think it's a song. It is indeed a song. What song let's is get it? Some shoes. Let's get some shoes. 
Let's get some shoes. Here we go, boy. I see you. Flame doesn't work underwater, right? Nope. Mm. Don't think so. Tragic. <laughs> gurgle, gurgle. I, I hear you gurgling some some drowned over there. I saw him, and they annoy me on an aesthetic level. They are not your aesthetic. Correct. Actually, ironically. Uh, there was a card game from Magic, or there was a card from the game Magic: The Gathering uh, called The Drowned that was uh, that I always wanted to own and never did. So it kind of was my aesthetic. But these fuckers are a different manner. Well, that's different. They have wronged you by flavor and design wise. That card never made any sense. It was a blue card for one blue mana, one one, and one black to regenerate, if I remember correctly. I think it eventually became a zombie, but like the original creature type was drowned, so it didn't really interact with any other cards, because nothing was like, all drowned get plus one, plus one. It was pretty silly. Huh. Oh, old school magic. I miss it, honestly. I, do. I can't play it anymore because I just I don't I can't spend that kind of money. Right. Uh, one of the most fun things I ever did was a few years back. Uh, I got a few people together. Uh, a llama just came wandering out of a cave over here. That I sounds think, about right. I think our friend might finally have escaped. Listen, it, who knows what llama that is? We no one knows. Literally, no one knows. Who knows it's... what llamas in the hearts of men? <laughs> it's I like the played... ingredients of pepperoni. No one knows what they are. And no one wants to. All right. Yeah, but I anyway. played back near Mirrodin Sorry, for a bit. Um, oh. And a little bit after. I Wait, still was that have... when you started? Uh, kind of around then. I, I'm... Oh, oh, oh. Mirrodin baby. and... Kamigawa and all that crap. Like I had some of the older stuff, but no, I didn't. I didn't start in like the older, older ones. I inherited gotcha. a collection from someone. Um, but Bearden was probably around when I started paying attention. Gotcha. But like, I still have my Sunburst deck and stuff, just because I kept a few decks when I quit and gave everything else away. Yeah, I have done that approximately three times now. <laughs> How's it working? I regret every time. Um, I mean, I haven't played in the last few years, so currently working technically this time? fine. Okay. Uh, mostly because of COVID at this point. That's I was about fair. to get back into it, and then COVID hit. But uh, one thing I did, this is what I wanted to say, and then I'll let other people talk again, whoops, uh, is uh, a few years back, uh, I got together with some friends from college at a reunion, and we all chipped in a bit, uh, and we got, what was it? Two packs of Homeland, or, or when I say packs, I mean like a box of Homeland. We got the last reasonably priced box of Mirage on the planet. And I want to say a box of Fallen Empires, which was objectively the worst expansion yes. of Magic the Gathering ever. Uh, and we ran them as just a crack booster draft. And it was the most fun I have maybe ever had playing Magic. Um, nice. Because like trying to win with one of those decks is just like <laughs> none of these cards are good. None of them. All right. Good luck. <laughs> right. I was a Yu-Gi-Oh kid, personally. Oh snap! I never played it. I do appreciate Yu-Gi-Oh the Abridged series, though. Yes. Yes. I am. I am sad that it came out before Dragon Ball Z abridged and never quite took off as well as DBZ abridged did, but I, uh, for what I before, love it. Just released a new episode like earlier this week. I, I saw that. I haven't watched it yet. I hadn't been watching it for a while, but it seemed pretty good. I Fuck all you finally... guys. I watched Sailor Moon. Who? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, I tried to good. get into Crystal. Sorry, go ahead. No, I mean. Sailor Moon was awesome. Yu-Gi-Oh! was just... I didn't have the patience to watch Yu-Gi-Oh! Because it was just like, alright, you're gonna play some do dumb, stupid no. card because of some dumb, stupid rule, whatever, fine. The end. <laughs> the show? The show was just full of cheaters. Cheaters and people that had hard-ons for dragons. Fast, actually. 
<laughs> and the latest episode does get into the dragon thing. Oh, Spider, you have made a terrible mistake. Hello. Come here, friend. Goodbye, friend. Crystal oh. rules, I have money. That's oh, kind uh... of what I got out of Yu-Gi-Oh, yes. <gasps> Did you bring did you bring me some some stuff? Oh, I do love stuff. Mmm, stuff. Mmm, that's more stuff. So much stuff. Thank you for the stuff. There's some coal I have. I enjoy like being stuffed. The last couple and of nights has been with real. ribs. That's right. Usually only by me though. Well, gotta spice it up every now and then. That's right. I love just my utter refusal to take leaves down when I farm trees. <laughs> you mean like so those leaves that are like floating like in the leaves. distance there? Yeah. <laughs> it's hilarious to watch them just disappear. I'm just like... Oh, I've... they do, huh? Yeah, leaves... Yeah, they will. With... Leaves if that there's are... there's no wood in them. Gotcha. Right. If if I have leaves... known people like that. Oh my! <laughs> this this sounds nice. like this is going to be like another college conversation. Oh no, that was really all I had to say about that. <laughs> all right, thanks, Forrest Gump. <laughs> <laughs> Can you really just start a conversation like that and leave it like that? I mean, he just did, didn't he? I mean, it was supposed to be an offhand comment. I didn't expect y'all to like double. No, this is a branching and... conversation. Have you? Have you? I'm sorry. Have you spent more than have thirty seconds in conversation with us? Uh, you are it's all either, in full flow. These conversations are either going to get lewd, pun filled, or they're just going to go on for way too long. There's yeah, like not, no in between. Why not both? <laughs> why not Zoidberg? We'll, we'll, match. we'll mix, mix and match for sure. One thing that I find are more common in Minecraft than in real life are these just like random sinkholes full of water. You're saying that to people that live in Florida. Yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> okay. Um, let me tell you, I there's. I was going to say diamonds are more common in Minecraft than real life. Also, Ooh. technically true. Let me tell you, um, in. There's uh, no the... De Beers organization. Ugh, that's true. <laughs> in in the next county, like north of us, um, there is a sinkhole that's been there for months now, and I know this because it made the news because the sinkhole was so big and right next to a major roadway. And uh, when we go to see Sabrina's mom, uh, we have to drive by it every time, and it's still there. And the one lane of traffic is blocked off. And the last excuse that the county gave as to why it hasn't been filled in yet is the geologist hasn't been out to confirm that it is indeed a sinkhole. And it's like, you know, there's a giant gaping hole in the ground uh, where road and sidewalk used to be. Um, and it looks like some kind of fucking like mineral deposit that made it collapse. So I'm no geologist. <laughs> But you I'm going to go out on a fucking limb here and say that it's probably a fucking sinkhole. You just, like, write to them and be like, Dear City, I'm a geologist. It's a sinkhole. <laughs> Love me. <laughs> Love me. Oh, Please shit. It's sleepy it now, times. Thanks. You're sleepy times. Damn. Like, Oh, wait. Affair. You said your thing got censored before. Did it just replace it with uh, hashtag? Mm at number signs? Yes. Yes, it did. Yeah. It didn't like Looter's Blade. Okay. Well. Oh my god. A disappointment then. Hold on. I may not rest there are monsters nearby. I'm working on that. Okay. Let's get some loads. Get some loads. Okay. Rip monster. <gasps> Kohler's here. Kohler, listen, as soon as this stream is over, uh, I'm going to see if I'm at affiliate and I will absolutely set it up to where you can subscribe, buddy. I am I am so glad you're here. I miss you. And yes, we have been playing a lot of Minecraft the last couple of weeks. Um, like you, you basically started this, this sinking ship. And oh, now so this we... Is all his fault? 
This is really his fault. Yeah, so uh, Kohler in the chat, that's actually Sabrina's sister-in-law's brother. Um, that's Sabrina's brother's wife's brother. Um, so, yeah, Hello. he's... He's been very square. busy. He's he, he's <laughs> he's working a lot of person. <laughs> he's working a lot of crazy hours right now, so he hasn't Mo! been able to watch. <gasps> Mo's here. Okay, so hey, everybody, everybody, Trouble. tell tell everybody what Mo did yesterday. What did Mo do? <laughs> oh, Trouble. oh, you know what Mo did. I know what Mo did, but I want Mo to tell me what Mo did. Oh, Mo didn't screw up. Mo didn't know. I'm so curious now. Well, oh, Mo just Mo just casually killed our Ender Dragon. It's fine. You know the you know the <laughs> end where we, end, we and, and she, she just let, casually let killed. The story. Yes. I, I got an idea. I, like she just she just walked into the end and she was like, "Oh, you're not dead yet." So she just smacked him down. <laughs> Just one right in his dragony face. Just, just one slap. Yeah, basically. And he was like, ah, I can't believe you've done this. And then fell over dead. <laughs> How dare. <laughs> I Like, he had a Fraser moment like, I am wounded. And then he fell. One punch. <laughs> one punch Mo. One punch Mo. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah. Sweet Mo. She didn't know. She thought we had already killed it once, and then she went there with all of her gear, and she's like, oh, God, it's not dead. And she basically, like, you know, she had to kill it to get home. <laughs> yep. So. Oh, uh, it's okay, Mo. We love you. We'll respawn the dragon eventually. I gotta get that achievement, because I've never, I've never slayed the dragon. Yeah, I've never killed the dragon on Java, either. Well, see, now you can kill it in Bedrock and get an Xbox Live achievement for it. Yes, for that Xbox I don't have yet. That's all right. You're getting one. I assuming that something doesn't happen. I don't. I don't count my uh, consoles before they deliver. You have, you don't count your consoles Wait. before they boot. Correct. You actually have one on its way to you. Uh, theoretically. theoretically. We're, we're getting an S. We're getting. We an S. Say we're getting a Series S because we are really only going to use it as a Game Pass box. Gotcha. We, we skipped the Xbox One, so it's either get a really cool Xbox One or get the S, because I'm not fighting for an X. Like, there's just no point. We're not I mean, really an Xbox household. To be fair, we didn't get a PS3 until, like, a halfway through the PS4's lifespan, and the only reason why we did that is because I was, uh... I can go into GameStop and not spend any money. I was an idiot and thought I could go to GameStop and not spend any money. Oh, sweet and... summer child. <laughs> I was like, oh, really? You really think we can do that? He's like, yeah, we can do that. Walks out with a new PS3 and some other stuff. Oh. And what did you learn? And the, the answer is nothing. You learned nothing. PS3 games are fun. <laughs> also, yeah. yes. Hey, and that's when we, uh, we started our Tales Addiction up again. Oh. I am hoping that one day, someday, many years from now, I will be able to find a PS5. Uh, but I'm not holding my breath. I'll wait until halfway through the lifespan when there's more games for it. Mo, do you need I... more glass or anything? Oh yeah, we 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 got you a lot more glass cooking, but I we don't know what other supplies you need for whatever you're going to be working on next. I like PlayStations. I just tend to wait till there's just more stuff out for them because I have literally never happens. owned one. It was going to be my Christmas gift to myself until I realized there was no way in hell I would be able to get a hold of one. That's um, fair. And then, um, see, the thing is, I have already paid for uh, digital copies of Spider-Man, like the the one for PS5 that includes both. Uh, and uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So there are digital copies of those just sitting there in the ether waiting for me to actually have a console to play them on. That's fair. Yeah, if you already have stuff, like, I'm just always, the only consoles I'm ever quick on are Nintendo consoles, and that's because Pokemon and Zelda and IPs. That's yeah, it. I've that's, been, honestly, I've that's been, all. Oh, go, go ahead. ahead. I've been, um, basically PC gamer plus Nintendo for 
ages now. I mean, yeah. let's be real. The the only reason any of us are buying Nintendo consoles anymore is purely for first party game nostalgia. That's it. That's the only reason. It's enough. That, but and, and, and that's the worst part. It is absolutely enough. It is enough for all of us. Well, and, and, I mean, the, to, be, to be honest, too, the Switch in and of itself is a pretty damn cool piece of hardware, just in general. It, it is. Neat. It is a neat piece of hardware. Yeah, and like I, I, I like like, and let's be real. Like the stuff that Nintendo does with their consoles is gimmicky. Like it is. It is absolutely gimmicky. I have the Nintendo or the the Animal Crossing Switch. You have I it. And... Have, yes, I have the Animal Crossing Switch. I pre-ordered it before everything happened, and I was about not to, but I'd sold some stuff and had some extra money, so I pre-ordered it. And when COVID hit, I was so very, very, very glad that I had pre-ordered it. And it's pretty. Like, it's really nice. But also, it's gimmicky. Like, just like anything else that Nintendo does, it's gimmicky. It's fair. All right, At least I it's gimmick to... is straightforward and is very, fair. very good. That's true. That's very true. Like, they are, they are, they are very open about the fact that it is, it is all gimmicky. I, I gotta say, Kohler, gaming PC is 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 a good thing. Like, it's a way to go. If we didn't have gaming PCs, I would absolutely get a gaming PC over an Xbox. But we have gaming PCs, so an Xbox is something different. An Xbox is, uh, and I think th this is where uh, Microsoft's trying to really point it at is either you get it either as a, a media center, or you get it as. Um, kind of a gaming PC budget alternative. Like you get it for yeah. a few hundred dollars because if you're going to, if a few hundred dollars is going to get you the graphics card on a decent gaming rig, rig that isn't going to be completely obsolete in like three days. I mean, right now thousand dollars might maybe if you could find one. So yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, well three, yeah, if, if you can find any of the 3000 series, then yes, my point is accurate, but yeah, well, and that's underestimating the cost. Yeah, so that's, that's got a pretty good bit budget on it. They're... Oh, did they finally fucking get it under control? So yes, that's yes, one of the big selling points of the three thousand series. Except that, like, you can't actually find any at retail. So, like, well, right now, if you're getting one, you are paying at least a thousand dollars. Yeah, and honestly, that's where uh, pre-built are making yeah. a lot of money right now because they can actually have them for you can get a pre-built with a 3070 or a 3080 in it for 1200 1500 bucks yeah i mean like i was looking i was looking uh a few nights ago like i think either maybe one night last week and cyber power has like a bunch of stuff that's like sub 2000 that you can get with 3070s in them and mm -hmm. i like like I've built machines. I've built machines for years and I'm I'm almost I'm almost at the point in my life where it's like I've I've done that so much and been in IT for so long. It's like, okay, that's fun the first like 10 times that you do it. But then eventually it's like I'm lazy now and I don't want to do this anymore. I just Isn't want to be cool? lazy. Is well, it fun when you're you're the person who's building your computer doesn't seat your RAM correctly? Hey, listen. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, listen, okay, I have to tell you all the story, okay. So, my f my first job, my first job, my first actual job I ever had, I worked at Chick-fil-A, because we all had our fast food jobs, right? We all worked in food at some point, basically. Um, hey there, PogChamp, we are playing Minecraft Bedrock. Uh, we've got a private realm that several of us are on, and right now we're just building out some pretty stuff. Um, I'm working on a big walkway, so... Got some. I got an old abandoned village over here that uh, Lollipop in the the Discord and the chat has cleaned up. We've got a barn here. We're just we're just making it feel even more homey. Um. So, I my my second job or my first job was at Chick Fil A. Also, I wore the cow suit. You're welcome. Um, my second <laughs> job. Um, I'm I'm just gonna steal all this. There we go. Ooh, thanks for the wood. Um, I'm some obsidian that I'm gonna mine up, by the way. Nice. 
KFC. Yep. See, every everybody everybody had their food job at some point. Everybody like it's it's like a rite of passage. Um, Wendy's. See. Um, I wound up doing mine at coffee shops. Th there you go. But that's it's still it's still food service. Um. So my second job, um, the next year. I actually, the day I turned 16, I started my uh, second job. I worked as an intern in my high school's IT department. And if that's Ooh. not the most fucking, like, on-brand me thing ever, I don't know what <laughs> is. Did you get promoted? Because no, I, be more on brand. I never got promoted in that job because I was an intern. I wasn't, like, a, a, like a full-time employee. Um, but I did get... Uh, I did get like course credit for it, so that's fine. Walmart counts. I mean, like, if not food, then retail. Like, that's that. I think that still counts because we we all had like our our like our busting our ass dealing with customer jobs. I it, mean, it, yeah, it's it's not about the 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 food prep or whatever prep you were doing. It was about the customers. Right. That it's about the fucking customers. To... That you had to try and not shoot yourself because they were so goddamn bad. Yeah. For them. So, I, you know, this was my first, like, actual IT. Did the map update? No, the map didn't update. We'll have to update the map soon. Um, so, this was my first, you know, IT job, obviously, because it's just my second job ever. And so, I'm like, all right, this is cool. This is, you know... I can do this. And I had been doing stuff with computers, like, basically my entire life. So, you know, I had been screwing around with this stuff forever. So I, 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 you know, I was at home. I was comfortable doing it. Uh, what do I need? I got more wood. I need to... Oh, it's actually at sleepy times. So I need to go do that first. Um, so... I also had a tendency to be the one, like, when things broke... Um, I also was the one who got blamed for it first because a lot of times I was the one that broke them. Um, that still happens by the way. Um, I am 19 years into my IT career now and I'm still the one breaking shit. He's a good kidderino. Look at the kidderino. He's such a good boy. He sits and, and brings Depending on his... who you ask, he breaks it whether he did it or not. That's also true. I still get blamed for it, whether or not I actually did it, <laughs> which again is fair. Um, so one day I'm working on a PC in what we call the tech shop. That was our, that was, you know, where we, we did all of our shit. Um, and you know, this was in the early two thousands. So we had a lot of older machines. I mean, we're a high school, we're a public school system. So we're not going to have the latest and greatest anyway. There's all there's all kinds of like old machines, hand me downs, shit like that. So um, I'm working on this older machine now. For those of you who have built your own PCs before, you know that there is a um, usually a two pin spot on the motherboard where you plug in the power button. So it provides a power. It provides a signal to the power button from the motherboard. You push the power button, it interrupts the signal, and the motherboard's like, okay, time to power on. Let's do it. Let's do this thing. In older machines, it wasn't like that. In older machines, they were four prongs, and they were actual electrical signals, not from the motherboard, but from the power supply directly. And so they had a positive, a negative, and two grounds. And let me tell you something. If you plug those in backwards and try to push the push button on the PC to turn it on, it can potentially trip the breakers for an entire hallway's worth of classrooms. <laughs> and teachers will run out of their classrooms because their computers and televisions and lights all go dark. And they'll come out and going, what happened? Did, what happened? What's going on? And when the lights also go out in the tech shop, your boss, <laughs> who faces away from the door and has like a little monkey rearview mirror, looks up at the rearview mirror and he goes, 
what did you do? Which is a fair <laughs> question because I plug the power supply in or the, the power button into the power supply backwards. And I le- learned to never do that again. <laughs> uh, excellent. So Speak- we've all been there. Speaking of breaking things early on and breaking things in tech early on, Chris knows my jo- my my ongoing joke is that my superpower is breaking things, and this is actually how I ended up with Chris. But before that, honestly, I'd say the first real manifestation of this that I can remember is that was Windows three point one. Oh yes. And <laughs> so oh, I can feel I this one like, already. I was like five. Maybe? I don't know. Somewhere where I knew what a computer was and knew how to, like, turn one on, but certainly didn't know enough about one to be, you know, messing around with things unsupervised. But then again, neither did my parents. Fair. So, Windows 3.1 had a lovely Tabworks mode that was the most awful way to try and get around Windows. I remember Tabworks! Me being the curious fuck I was, got it stuck in Tabworks mode and didn't figure out how to get it unstuck for several years. Oh, that's incredible. I thought you were going to say days, but no, no. It was no, much years. better. It was years because I, I I remember being like, I don't know, eight or something or something like something older and wiser than I'm like, oh, my God, this was a setting this whole time because it just was in tab works mode. Suddenly, I assume I was just being a dumbass and did something. I have no idea what at this point. And it was in tab works mode. And my parents were like, what's this? And I'm like, oh, Uh they didn't know how to fix it. I don't know what it's doing. And literally, I think like a few months before we replaced and upgraded the machine, I figured out how to get it out of Tabworks mode. Let me tell you, Tabworks mode is the worst way to use 3.1. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like there was there was like at that time there was so much like weird shit that would that that like manu- PC manufacturers would put on top of Windows. Like Packard Bell had this shit that they put on this, the Packard Bell Navigator. That was like, what in the fuck is this supposed to do? It was so fucking grody. But, I mean, that was the the thing at that time. Like, Windows was considered ugly. So, like, at that time, in, like, the early 90s, everybody was starting to get into multimedia. And that's that was the new, like, oh, thing. God. Remember, remember everything was, was multimedia. Tagline? Huh? Oh, my God. I just said, remember when that was the tagline? I'm just remembering uh, some some projects i had in school that required like your your uh not speech but like your presentation must include some form of multi-media yes Uh, multi-media which eventually by thankfully by the time i was in high school just meant you were doing a powerpoint presentation yep yeah like yes Spells in, spells in in the chat talking about, it's like, they're like, as an electrician, I've blown up enough shit in my early days. Listen, I still blow up shit. I write code for a living now, so I no longer do hardware. I do software and I still blow shit up just in a different way. And I have to be extra careful about it now because I work for a financial institution. So (laughs) if I blow shit up the right way, shit goes very wrong. Yeah. See, I think I've infected Chris with my superpower because I break things. And so how Chris and I met was we met online. And so the first time we met, I had a keyboard that had just stopped working. So I brought it with me because he said he was like techie. And I was like, well, maybe if I give him the keyboard, I'll have a reason to invite him like over the next time because hello, I have to think these things through. And like, I was like, well, it's already broken. So if I give it to him and he's like creepy or crazy or something and I don't want to see him again, it's not like I'm losing anything because I'm certainly not going to fix it. Somehow and, I, I ended up seeing her a second time. And Even best case. Being creepy and crazy. <laughs> you played it close creepy. to the vest and I, I appreciate that. <laughs> um, so I gave him the you keyboard. appreciate about him? Yes. <laughs> and then... Uh, and then I kid, and and he took it home and plugged it in and it worked immediately. So he cleaned it out for me and whatever, brought it over, got it all set up on my computer because it was one of the like fancier keyboards that I'd inherited from a friend who just like replaced it instead of cleaning it. So like, okay, whatever. So got it all set up, was working, was using it on my computer. I sit down, keyboard stops working. 
immediately. Oh no. So he gets it working again. But fast forward a few years to my last PC build. And we ended up returning the motherboard and getting a second set of RAM. And it turns out that it was all probably because the RAM wasn't seated properly. Because both motherboards weren't working. Because we'd gotten a second one and we were working on the exchange process. Oh, no. And nothing was there. So I come in and I look and I'm like, this isn't seated right. Because I go away when he works on my computer. Because I'm just, I'm just an anxious ball of, oh, God, you're going to break it all. So it's just best for me to normally not be in the room during it. And I come in and I'm looking at it and I'm like, this RAM isn't seated all the way. He's like, what do you mean? I'm like, you can see the, the, the pins on the bottom. Sure enough, starts working yeah. after that. So I've just decided Aww. I've infected him with my superpower. Oh, that's that's pretty. I got to tell you, that's that's kind of cute. I could almost vomit. <laughs> almost, but not almost, quite. not quite, but almost. That's fair. All right. Hey, so um, I cleaned out the whoop. the side of the barn, right, so it's nice and. Falling into lava. Whoop! If anyone was wondering. Hey, don't fall into lava. I didn't. <laughs> spells almost. and ram is just awful. It ram is. is. It's spells and you're absolutely like it's always. It's always the fucking ram. Always, every time. Yeah. When I met Chris, he was trying to diagnose a friend's RAM issues. So, it's always the RAM. It's always the RAM. And when it's not the RAM, it's still the RAM. Ah. <laughs> Can't get at me, can you, you stupid booze? Turns Jones, out giant are you, oozes are you, can't get through. Are you shit talking the mobs? Yes. Okay, I that's mean, fair. It's enormous and can't get through a door, and therefore I was able to. Okay, I just had one completely vanish on me. Is that common for oozes? Uh, mm, kinda. From like the mob just just disappeared on you. Yup. Eh, that yeah, that can't happen. Like, it was 20 or more blocks away, and I was headed toward it to fight it, and then it just, whoop. So if if they have, distance, yeah, yeah. If if you have, if you if like if they've been around for a while, if they've been spawned for okay. a while, eventually they will despawn. Yeah, that would probably be what happened there. Yeah. Whoop! Hello, lava. Nice to see you. Hey, buddy. Hello. Got any more of that? Uh, got any more of that spruce? It's growing. Okay, that's that's fair. At this point, we're gonna need a path to the bamboo so we stop having to swim to that. Would Would you like me to build a path to the bamboo off of the main That'd line be here? Nice. That'd be nice. A no, you bamboo. know what? We need Branch. we we sh we should probably put the bamboo somewhere else. We should probably actually build like a legitimate bamboo farm. I mean, you get some Night, sticky Thunder pistons Thunder. or some something like that, and Thunder you uh, just automate it. Do we need sticky pistons, or shouldn't we just get like regular pistons and observer blocks? I thought it was sticky pistons, but yeah, we could do that. I was thinking it was just like regular ones, because then we we put a, we'll put an observer like way up, put some redstone coming down to a piston to just push like the next to the bottom one, but what and then the bamboo shy. Well, that's just... Yeah, see, Mo says you should be able to do a simple one with observers and pistons. Uh -huh. See, I know, like, I know, like, three things. And I got one right. Like, go me. I know three things. And I have six cats. No, you don't. <laughs> no, you don't. He is a cat. He, he, do he is a cat. He is and a he cat. Has a cat. And you better keep that cat oh, safe, because no. I still might threaten to eat that cat. Don't eat the cat. Once again, I cannot condone the eating of the cat. That's fine. I cannot condone the peeing on the beanbag. Well, that's... <laughs> I mean, that's also fair. So, so one got, uh, one no condone that begets one. another. Mo, Mo actually has five cats, and that's listen... Amazing. 
first of all, you should be following. First of all, you should be following Mo's channel because she is the queen of dying in Minecraft. Um, you'll see it here. You'll see her here sometimes dying, but like her best deaths are always. She saves those for her stream. Um, I think you have to do. I think you have to do the at when you do the shout out. Uh. Let me try it. Let me see if I can do it. And... Here's there we go. Uh -huh. Yeah, there you go. I was close. Um, it's all right. Um, so, like, in in fact, her her pre roll on her channel is just like basically her dying greatest hits, which is I must say just <laughs> just chef's kiss. Um, but. Yeah, Mo Mo's Discord. She will occasionally post pictures of all of her kitties, and they are very good kitties. Like the other day, oh, she wasn't we feeling want a well. Pet? No, don't give her Liara. <laughs> Lockhart will be very sad. Who's not in bed? Me. I'm working on it, but you're also maybe not in bed. So I'm in bed. We we've, we've got. I'm, I got proof that I'm. Look, it's right there. I'm in bed. Right there. We have two cats and a dog, but we have we have floof cat, asshole cat, firm cat. <laughs> firm cat is the dog. We've got Roomby cat, which is you the do, Roomba. You do have a Roomby cat. Who bangs at the door when the Roomby's trying to do its thing? We like call Roomby cat does. We call our Roomba, we call it Jarvis, like from Iron Man, because it runs the house. Nice. Oh, when it comes to running the house, we, we for one, uh, have just accepted our Google overlords. I mean, you know, we have an app and we tell it to do its thing, but also... Yum. I mean, Google even tells Roomby what to do for us. Yeah, we don't let room be auto run because we do not want cat poop dragged across the floor. <laughs> That's probably a good call. That's, I mean, honestly, like, fair on that one. like I, I, I too do not enjoy cat poop smeared across the floor. So Mo we says we has angel kitty, sassy bitch monster kitty, handsome kitty, dumb kitty, and fat kitty. I Listen. like fat kitty and dumb kitty. Those are my favorite kitties of those kitties. Listen, okay, so uh, you know what? Fuck the leaves. I don't care anymore. We have like a thousand <laughs> fucking saplings. Um, so let me tell you. Um, so Sabrina's sister in law, um, her mom has this cat. Okay, this cat's name is Mister Meowgi, and he is the fattest name. fucking cat I've ever encountered personally. He's such a fat fuck, and I love him. And so Sabrina, like we 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 were in Louisiana, um, like for um, for her brother's wedding, and so you know we went to her sister in law's house, uh, or her sister in law's mom's house, and I met the cat, and I bonded with this cat instantly. Like he's such a sweet boy, but like I kept calling him fat fucker. And Sabrina's like, stop calling him that. That's so mean. I'm like, no, it's not. It's a term of endearment. He knows that I love him. <laughs> and he did. He's such a good boy, the Meowgi. Yeah, the zombie. Fuck you. You know, you still get the, uh, you get saplings still, right? Like, they will. They'll still drop the saplings. You just have to come back and collect them later. Oh, I thought if you I had to actually. three zombies in a row. Sorry to interrupt. If I find three zombies in a row, uh, have I found a spawner or nah. no? I think I just found um, a dark area. It's not guaranteed because zombies. If you're underground, zombies can just show up. Yeah, because you know how dark it gets down there. Yep, I have just lightened the area they appeared from. Uh, how far does the eastern tunnel now go? Yes. Yes. Um, <laughs> that was sort of the impression. I think it's around 2,000 blocks. Um, around 1,100 is the stronghold. Okay, well, I'm not probably going to go that far on my own tonight. Yeah, again, 
have to drop here in a few. Again, uh, Elon has been digging. I w- you said I could continue it, so I was, no, I was shooting. No, absolutely, and I'm glad you did. I was shooting I just... for a goal of, like, roughly 2,000 in each direction before I started on other goals, like the Ocean Temple that I want to <laughs> eventually dig towards, and I have a place oh. that I want, have a project I want to work on. But Sweet I'm, Bubba that, Cat. Once I dig out to where I'm going to, then I'm going to try and dig out to the, like, 6,000. I need to, did I pin those coordinates? Did you put those coordinates, the ocean coordinates in there? I don't I think so. Um... Because you were like, that's far away. And I'm like, but, mm. but, um, I'll find it at some point. Put them, put them in there again and I'll, I'll, I'll be sure to add them. I think I might've missed them. Eh, yeah. That's, that's close enough. Yeah. Cause you were like, Come you're, you're far away. You're real far. <laughs> you're a uh, real far. Yeah. <laughs> I, was like, I'm I think that's in- exactly what I said. You're a uh, real far. I was still in four digits. It wasn't that bad. But yeah, that's probably the next place I'm tunneling to is uh, 6,820 and then out to 1757. But yeah. I wish you the best of luck. I will stay closer to home. (laughs) So there's this uh, there's this artist named Anna Akana and she has six uh, cats. She has six, well, had six cats. She has five now, but um, Poor ghost. mm, she made a song called I Have Six Cats. It is great. It, you've heard half of it just in, in the chat. I guess. Just just from the two of you, yes. <laughs> and the best part about it is that one of her cats is named Congress because he's dumb, he's dumb and he doesn't, he doesn't do, do anything. anything. He doesn't do anything. Yes, yes, I remember that part of the song. This uh, is Congress. He's dumb and he doesn't do anything. <laughs> Oh, kitty. Um, okay, I have almost a stack and a half. What's uh, what's my? Where else do I got one around here? You, you're you my next victim. You have a stack victim. and a half. I have a stack and a half. Really? Ish. Aww. Ish. I've emptied yeah. the, the box of pre-made torches. This I'm also sad. ish. Oh, well, have a good night, Mo. Thank you for stopping by. I hope your stream was amazing tonight. Try not to kill any more Ender Dragons while we're gone. (laughs) Thanks for one hand punching the dragon for us. Oh, wait. No, that's just... That's two. Okay, that's just one. Yeah. Well, the other one was just for her to, like, be even. It wasn't actually at the dragon. It was just a... Oh, I see. I I see. I like one hand punch as opposed to one punch man. (laughs) One punch, Mo. <laughs> One hand punch, as, a, as opposed to the common two-handed punch you see. <laughs> well, she, never she, could, she could have at least had enough common decency to pull a DBZ and take like six episodes to do anything. Oh, that's that's a good point. Wait, what happened? To... Again, what happened to? Where did it go? Happened. Where did what go? There was a piece of wood that was like, oh man, did I lose it? Oh man. Oh Swiper man. No swiping. Oh <laughs> man. Well, I guess I do have a spoon, don't I? Spoony, spoony, spoon, 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 spoon. So, okay, tell me for a second oh, about God. magma blocks. <laughs> they hurt your feet. Okay. Uh, are they useful for anything? I don't know if this They is hurt your rock. feet. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Just going to put stuff on top of those. Then. Thank you for the delivery. They're, they're useful for when you want to hurt your feet. <laughs> or other yeah, people's no, I feet. Did, I have, in fact, picked... Okay. If you keep it up, I'm going to bring them back and put them on your feet. Are your feet too comfortable? Have they been giving you so much trouble lately just because they're just so damn soft and and, and comfy? Well, we have the solution. Magma blocks. Magma blocks. To show your feet who's fucking boss. <laughs> I, and I have broken Elena. <laughs> Welp. That's fantastic. Thanks for coming to our stream today. 
<laughs> oh, wow. <coughs> Breathing. Yeah, do that. That's good. That's good. That's that's a first step. I too forget to breathe sometimes. Usually that kind of laugh is reserved for when I Elcor. Accurate. When you what? Yeah. Elcor from Mass Effect. They they speak in a um they, they don't they don't have the ability to express emotion. They speak entirely uh, monotone. So they have learned as a species to um start all of their sentences with the emotion the name of the that emotion. they're trying. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So with while, deep concern they will go into all the details about how they don't know what you're talking about and other various things yeah so like and this version is basically like incredibly amused that was an in, that was a uh, very funny uh, bit that you just did I'm, I'm i have that. the elcor plushie and it's got unique lines and it's kind of adorable and i think that might be what chris is going to get if he can find it, because he bought me the Elcor plushie at one point, because I didn't super get into Mass Effect. I still need to play it again, but I adore the it's... Elcor. I'm trying to remember what these fellas look like. Elephants. Without the noses. Oh, yeah, I remember and them now. Are they in the... They're in the original trilogy? They're in the first one. Yeah, they're in the first one. Oh. Okay. Yeah, because like you're you're. Look them up later. Bring it yeah. here, Chris, because your sensitivity is way too low. Oh no, he's too quiet. But like, it's uncontrollable glee. Ha ha, <laughs> that tickles. Superstitious fear. Can you check under the bed for reapers? Oh my can God! Can sure. does it really say? Can you check under the bed? Yes. Yes. That's Can you check beautiful. Under the bed for Reapers. Can you check up the closet too? Manipulative um. begging. Can we go see Blasto Six, please? <laughs> Manipulative begging. That's extremely good. <laughs> so I just love them, and occasionally Chris will like Elcor at me for something he wants, and I just lose it, and that is usually the laugh. That's the laugh when I'm just losing it, and. I might forget to breathe because I'm just, I'm dead. I'm slain. S sometimes I laugh so hard. Okay, so I'm, I'm a big fella, but I also have like a really powerful diaphragm muscle. Um, I marched tuba my freshman year of high school, just Hell to give you an idea. Yeah. That's right. Low brass, baby. Um, oh, I think all that part's done now. I just got to make the fence. Am I the um, only one who wasn't a band kid? Probably, yeah. I played, I played the clarinet, so I wasn't really on the same level. Oh, uh, woodwinds! Uh, you were no. one of the honorary. I'm pretty sure oh. Elena was one of the honorary band kids. Like, wasn't in band, but hung around with all the kids, so she might as well have been in band. Uh, uh, somewhat, right. because I was in the choir. I was, I was one of the choir kids who hung out with all the band. Uh, uh, yeah, but like, um, woodwinds represent. I started on flute, so go for it. Flute Hell to yeah. tuba is a move. You're you're not kidding, son. You're telling me. Um, so sometimes when I laugh, it's so like it's it just gets so wild that I actually like cut off oxygen to my brain temporarily, <laughs> so I can't see. Does that go to bed? So, oh, am I the only one not in bed? No, I'm working on it. Hang on. You're the only one I can see that's not in bed. Oh, so so really what you're saying is you're just going to blame me because you can see my screen. Correct. Correct. Yeah, screen watcher. Stop sleep right. sniping, Zach. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You're, you, you are sleep camping. <laughs> I'm okay with this. Um, so anyway... Um, so uh, sometimes I'll laugh so hard that I actually cut off like like I can't see for a second. So like I'm fine and I'm I'm aware that I'm fine, but like I can't see. 
So like I just like I black out for just a second and you'll know You're this. Huh? You're in laugh shock. I'm in laugh shock. Yeah, it, it, essentially. So then what I'll do is like I'll do this thing where like I kind of wave my hands in front of my face so Sabrina knows that I'm like I'm alive but also I'm blacked out cuz I'm laughing so hard and it's just hilarious. Hey, there's a witch up there. <laughs> Witch is up there. Is it a sandwich? No. It's a man witch. Ooh. <sighs> hey, hey, none of that. We still got like three minutes left. Yeah, I'm coming back to drop off some uh, some obsidian before I knock off for the night. Don't look at the 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 ore chest then. You don't want to see your hard work undone. <laughs> oh God, what have you done now? I don't know. I don't remember what I put in there. I don't know. I if forgot. There are diamonds or I emeralds, surf. I will get them tonight. Otherwise, they will have to wait. Oh yeah, they can. They it all can wait. We have diamonds, so I'm just. I'm yeah, just but I crap. like mining diamonds and emeralds. Makes me I mean, feel like fair. a useful engine. You are useful. Listen, I'm just going around making pretty pathways all around the base. So, I mean, what the hell am I doing? I literally paid to do that. I feel like that's a valuable... It is. It's a very valuable... Wait, how am I paid to do it? People, no, get, I'm people pay life. for, like... Oh, oh. Witch up there. Can I shoot them? Yeah, you, yeah sh shoot the witch. It, Burn I the feel witch. Like you will get paid to do it. Burn the oh, witch. that's true. That's true. I think after tonight, I should make affiliate, y'all. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. Oof, that's some Dude, lag. Shoot me a message when you do, because I, I will sub... Awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, yeah. Going up top to fight the witch. I think... Well, I, also, now that I have um, over 50 um, followers, I should have VIP slots unlocked after this, so I gotta make sure to put y'all in VIP slots. Do witches you... just unspawn? No, I the witch fell it. down. The witch, the witch is in the water. Oh. Yeah, hello, it witch. very angry at you. Oh yeah, that witch is Good. pissed. Got it. The witch won't Aww. even pay attention to Zach because it was just like it was like it was <laughs> it was looking for you. Like that's how pissed it was. Excellent. I thought it had gone up top, so I went up top. Oh, and gotcha. I narrowly made it into the water on that jump. I very nearly uh, did not splat. Oh well. Yeah. <laughs> I was about to be like, uh, Zach, can you pick up my? Dis disappointment sword before the witch does. Sure, sure. I would be glad to pick up your dead body. <laughs> that's that's one of the many services Blah. I provide. I provide lots of ore for other people to mine. That's my service. That's that's very true. All right, let's see. Uh, that should that should give me. Most we have of the way. thirty-seven obsidian now, for what it's worth. Ooh, oh, plus the seven new obsidian. Plus the nice. secret twenty that I have in my inner chest. Nice. I only oh, keep it. Not really a there, secret but... if you tell everyone. <laughs> yeah, but if but you can't get to it. That's true. Well, the first thing you need to do is hack his Facebook. But not being able to Damn. get something doesn't make it a secret. If you can't there are see plenty it. Plenty of things I can't get to. Well. They aren't secrets. They could be. But they if aren't. You, if you believe hard enough, they could be. I'm pretty sure secrets don't work <laughs> that way. Yeah, Elon, if you just put your mind to it, I'm sure you'll figure it out. If you just put your mind to it, sir. Oh! Uh, I see a, we're there's a story that. behind that. <laughs> there is indeed a story around. behind that. You almost got broken up with that day. Uh-huh. Oh, Jesus it God. It was a misunderstanding, too. That's the worst part about it. <laughs> okay. We're gonna. I, I want to hear this story, but we're gonna have to save that one for Friday, because it fair. is it is ten thirty and it is it is about time to call it. Um, it is a bear's hibernation time. It is time for a bear to go hibernate, and it's, tomorrow is Thursday, which for me means a absolute just ridiculous shit ton of meetings that I don't want to go to. Um, Ooh. yeah, actually, thank you for reminding me. You are oh, you not got... one that. Yeah, so yeah. Let me I tell train you. Train some people tomorrow. 
Oh, well, that, I mean, that's, that's good though, right? No, that's, it's good. Sorry. I don't mean to say that that's bad, but I have to get up early to do it, which a bear is not enthusiastic about. I, as, as a bear, I also understand this. Um, so yeah, um, we, we have our new underwater entrance. Uh, we've got our new, um, our new main nether portal hub underneath everything, which is, I gotta say, I'm I'm pretty happy about. Um, we've got most of the walkway to the um, directly to the the village dock done, which is nice. And I'm probably gonna modify that dock before too terribly long. I've tunneled uh, most of the way to where I want to do my project. Not all the way, but I'm out of three thirty five hundred spaces I needed to tunnel. I'm like at 2800 or so oh nice that's nice. that's pretty good so i'll be almost done with that and then i can start working on uh ocean tunneling nice mm, ocean tunneling there we go all right so i still need another lantern to put there but i can get that tomorrow so yeah Where um sugar cane go again real quick we don't have it <laughs> that's right next to it Right next to the sugar oh, cane farm. Right, that's right. Gotcha. Yeah. All right. So yeah. Um. Did I put? Yeah, I put torches there. All right. So nothing should spawn here because this is all bottom slab. I know it's going to get a little dark at night. That's okay. We're protected by the fencing. Um. So we should be all good there. Um. By the way, like I gotta tell you, lollipop. I just I love seeing the blue. Ah. <laughs> nice. I love seeing the blue banner just up there. Uh, let's see what else we got down here. So our underwater Sorry, entrance. I just got that on the stream. That went well. That was fantastic. Got our underwater entrance going on here. Um, going in the back here, everything. There's our, our new main nether portal hub. Oh, look. A zombie pigman has made it through. Well, that's just peachy. Get back in there. No, I said get in there. No. I didn't know things could come through from that side. They sure they can, can Bob. They can come <laughs> in. They can go through. So animals can end up meandering their way in there. And oh, if you shoot a projectile like through the portal, it will come out the other side and hit someone. Yeah, the yeah they're, they, they will absolutely do that. So if... If Thank I were to shoot an arrow head. through I'm and somehow that away. arrow were to hit the um, the zombie pigman, he will get pissed and he will come for me. Excellent. No All right. Well, I think I think that is about it for us tonight. Um, thanks, y'all, for coming and hang out. Um, don't forget, if you enjoyed what you saw, please, please follow. Um, I would greatly appreciate it. Um, Oh, wait, wait. Are you going to Okay, wave again. I had I turned off the 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 game feed. Wave. Oh, there you go. <laughs> there we go. Yay. Okay. All right. <laughs> and face plant. Um all right. So, again, thanks everybody for for watching. Um I appreciate it. Uh we'll be back on Friday night for Friday night happy hour. Um same time, 7:30 p.m. Eastern. Uh we'll be going to about 11 or so. Um, so we're going to be doing a lot more of this. Um, I think Tom Ocarina of Tom will be joining us and he'll be finishing up, um, the first part of the new villager trading post that he's been working on. So that'll be really cool. We can go see some of that in action. Um, and that's, uh, it, yeah, it's, it's been fantastic. So again, thank you all for joining and we'll hope to see you again soon. Take care.